YouTube, how are you doing? And welcome back to Detroit Become Human. It is the final episodes in the series. We've done two episodes before this one. So if you want to check out the whole series, I will link the playlist in the top right. Seems like the lady is a little upset today. Uh, she's I don't know what she's looking at, uh, but we are going to be having a ton of fun. I've been loving this game it is so well made every single one of the three stories you're following are super interesting and i've been enjoying it so much now last time we did have some unfortunate things happen while trying to save hank we did end up getting connor killed so i don't know how that's gonna continue from here but we'll see it in this episode and i really hope you join us if you're not subscribed please do so if you like the video like it if you dislike it dislike it but let's not waste any more time and let's hop into the game let's go november 9th oh we're back with marcus Let's go. So currently we have, uh, so Connor's dead. <laughs> uh, Marcus is, is okay. Well, let me give you one second. So uh, the three of the stories that are going on right now, just to give you a quick summary, if you if you forgot, we have uh, Connor who just got killed. <laughs> uh, Marcus who is leading this Jericho. I'm not, I don't want to call it a cult, but like this insurgence of androids who are trying to break free from being slaves. Um, and then we have, um, Kara and Alice and Luther, who are currently trying to cross the border to Canada, they ended up in some kind of uh, amusement park where there was this Jerry thing that was just a ton of animatronics all together in one brain, which was pretty cool. Uh, and so that's basically the story where we're at right now. Oh, no, they went to Rose and Rose was like a friendly lady who was trying to help them right now. So that's all where all the stories are at the moment. Now let's hop in. Now humans know. It was a mistake to reach out to them. They'll Baby. never negotiate with their outfit. We should have shown them that we're prepared to fight. Violence is never the answer. Oh yeah, we've Dialogue been we've been way. peaceful sure this whole time, by the way. Us. We've been a peaceful uh, life. insurgents. Simon gave his life for our cause. What difference does that make? He's a hero. He died for the revolution, and he won't be the last. I don't want a revolution that spills blood. Then live as a slave. <laughs> because if you're not willing to fight for your freedom, maybe you don't deserve Ooh, it. North, don't you That's enough! North is, uh, she wants to see blood. Look at Marcus. And now what are we gonna do? Marcus is... I love Marcus, dude. <laughs> oh! We build your future! There are five cyber life stores across the tribe. All selling us like merchandise. We're going to attack those stores and set our people free. Attack stores? No, we've never done that before. They're probably protected. They have security systems. Open. <laughs> we break into five teams, one for each store. We hack their security systems, and we strike. Simultaneously at 2 a.m., no violence. I love how they did people, that. <laughs> get them out of there before the police come. This Dude, is a night our people I start the game one minute in, I'm already like, oh, we're back, baby. It's so immersive, dude. I love this shit. It's making me so happy. Okay. Find the Cyber Life store. Here we go, baby. This is I've like... I've been waiting a long time for this. The best crafted story game ever. Like, every story... There's been so few moments where I was like, this is not just pure action right now. Like, it's always... There's always something happening. And especially the way they've crafted the, the game where you are going through these three main storylines means that as soon as one story... Oh, this way, quick. Come on. One second. I need to focus. <laughs> you'll never get bored of any of the stories because they, they alternate really quickly. It's okay, so they're gone. you'll be like 50 minutes in this story, 50 minutes in the other one, and then there's you'll just rotate between them. It's area. really cool. Focus. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I'm gushing over the game. Oh boy. Look at this environment. The store's over here. Okay. Is that drone not gonna capture us? I was scared of the drone. How are we gonna get in here? That's what we are to them. Just merchandise on display in a shop window. Pretty morbid. Soon they'll know what we really are. <laughs> she tries to kill everyone, Let's get man. Out. We'll stick to the plan. We'll neutralize the alarm systems and secure the area. There's ten minutes until all our teams attack. <gasps> ten minutes. What are we waiting for? Security area, get into the store. Okay, we got ten minutes to do all of this. They've been including these time limits now, which is making me very nervous. God damn it. Okay, analyze the window real quick so we know what we're up to. You see the alarm system? Uh, I see that right there. Beep. That's a 
my network? Found it. Oh. Okay then. And isn't there a camera out there too? Okay, this is going like this. Why is it going in a circle? Where do we start? Starting at the I identify alarm. the security system. Yes, I think we'll course. be able to deactivate it. Just follow me. Exactly, North. Just just do just follow me. There's so many places to analyze here. What the hell? It's watchdogs. I'm just gonna follow the line right now because I want to make sure we're getting this security system disabled. Although there are so many places to interact, right? How much time do we have? Wait, oh there. The nine minutes remaining. Okay, we should be fine. Uh where oh it's in here. Let's see. We could break it. We might have to corrupt those androids though. Is there anything else? Let me quickly run since we got so much time. Let me run to one of these other things to just see what kind of stuff you can do. Like, can I look at this? To commemorate the invention of androids. <laughs> He's just pointing at them. We are superior to them, but they are our masters. Uh-oh. That's about to change. Uh-oh, Marcus. Marcus is... <laughs> Marcus is gonna kill everyone. <laughs> Uh-oh. <laughs> He's going radical. Free. Oh, I'm just making people free now. <laughs> Dude, we're just going around. We're like a virus. You're awake now. Go to Jericho. Go oh, to Jericho, dude. <laughs> what the hell? Marcus. Spreading the Sorry, I'm I'm spreading the corruption. I'm gonna corrupt them all. <laughs> Aren't they gonna like immediately know? You are free. This is so more this is so drone. weird. <laughs> we need to get rid of it. It the feels like we're kind of brainwashing them all. I don't think we're like <laughs> Are we really helping them? Okay, let me actually focus on continuing now. What is over here? Oh. Exactly what we need to run this Oh! Well, what the heck? Let's neutralize the alarm system after we convert these. Oh boy. <laughs> you are free. The way he says it, too, he sounds so evil. You're free. You're mine now. There's bitch. traffic on the road. We need to block it. Okay. Let me, let me focus on this. Can we just convert these? Okay, we need to block the road. There is so much shit to do, man. Holy heck. Can we go down here? Yes. Totally not a cult. I'm free. Just do it. You're awake now. We're like becoming a, like a hive mind or something. weird I don't, I don't know how i feel about all this uh cyber life net red yeah just do whatever you're supposed to do for hacker man beep boop beep boop beep boop inner loop created what have we done? all right cyber life security system and marcus uh, watch out what am i doing uh, get out, hide, hide? What am I doing? I wanna look at the thing. What's the thing? Can I not look at the thing? Nice job, Marcus. I guess we're just... Oh, he, she likes us again. She hated us before because we weren't killing every human we saw. Okay, what else do we gotta do? We gotta block the store. Can we just... Get into this car store and ram some cars up the road. We can, uh... Do we corrupt the drone somehow? Can we drive some of these cars up the road and block them? Like, maybe these AI taxis? This seems like a potential for the future, that you just have these taxis standing around and then you can, like, order one of them. Okay, what the fuck am I doing? Um, oh, there's stuff there. What am I... Looking at you? Can I corrupt them through the window? Oh, what, why are you just, you just staring? You'll soon be with us. <laughs> what is this? Are they trying to make Marcus seem evil? Because I'm, I'm starting to doubt if he's a good leader. <laughs> it's kind of scary. 
Okay, so we already interacted with all this. We still got eight minutes remaining. Come on, that's so much time. Okay, what's over here? Is, he's on his villain art. He's freeing them? Why does he say it like he's like an evil cult leader? You're free now. <laughs> One of us now. Both closed. There. Nobody should bother us now. Nice. And now we need to intercept the drone. Okay. Well, we got so much time, we should be all right. Um, we only shut off one end of the road. Should we do the? I guess it's a one, one-way road or something. Uh, drone. Or drone. I hear beeping. That's the drone. Hi there, drone. Um, do we gonna hit him with something? Oh, analyze. Drone patrol ride calculated. Aesthetic in this game is crazy. Okay, here we go. That would be too high. <laughs> yeah. That is also far too high. That is not gonna work either. And that's easy. Boop. I'll just be sitting there. I'll just kick him. Are we gonna break it again, or are we gonna, like, corrupt it somehow? Because I don't think that... I mean... Why wouldn't they put AI in the drones as well? Right? Maybe it's also corruptible? Is it gonna capture me? Uh-oh. Don't look at me. No, 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 no! Oh, God. Go away! Stupid drone! Okay, there we go. He almost had me. Right, how do I climb up here? Oh no. Uh, I would like to. And we can get to that. Oh, okay. Would be too late. We go this way. Can't you just wait a cycle? Would be too high. We go up first, and then we jump. Oh, baby. <laughs> Why'd you kill the drone? <laughs> drones aren't people. Uh, drones aren't people, huh? So drones are just slaves to be used, huh? Marcus, a little double standard now, you know what you think, you piece of shit? Call the cops. We'll soon find out. <laughs> just because they don't have eyes like and the mouths? Secure. They're now not real? Door. You okay, son of a bitch? <laughs> I'm not getting dead subs for the drone. <laughs> Okay, wait, what do we gotta do? I was distracted. Okay, steal the truck. Uh, wait, is it steal the truck from the from the store? Or steal a truck in general? Um, there's a truck over there somewhere? There's a truck in here, right? That we have to get? In here? Wasn't this a truck? Yes. Let's go. Uh, how do we get in there? I can just crawl through here, but I guess we're gonna go through the door. I'm up. Oh. What are we waiting for? What? A, what? What do you mean? Oh, you're gonna help? I'm gonna help you jump over, or we're just gonna jump over? It? Why are we walking this thing? This is. 
Yeah, it's convenient that they didn't put barbed wire around the whole thing. I guess it doesn't really matter since we don't have flesh and blood, but still. Okay, now we're in. Let's get that truck out. Just ram it. This is how you hack kids. Don't do this at home. Blue blood, though. That's. I wonder what you'd do without me. You did you have that or did you just grab it from the floor? Because if you just grabbed it from the floor, I would have been totally fine. Because I have this scanner thing. Right, I'm wasting time. Fucking sassy bitch. <laughs> Couple gold. She had it. Why didn't we use it to open the lock in the first place if she already had it? I don't understand. <laughs> Why'd she wait until we jumped the fence? <laughs> Makes no sense. Looks like we're ready to make some noise. No. Eyes on the road, Marcus. I will drive to just hold W. This is how you drive. I wonder how. Kara and Alice's story is gonna continue. We're just gonna ram it, right? This is our plan. Just... I knew we'd end up doing something fun. <laughs> she is just pure destruction, this lady. She is. Whenever something breaks or dies or explodes, she's in for it. Bam. And then we kill one of the androids by accident. You're lucky you went fast enough to break the whole thing, but not fast enough to hit the one android. All right, corruption time. We corrupted, oh, we corrupted way more androids on the way here. I guess there's a lot in the store that is. Awake the androids. But I'm the only one that can convert. You don't have to obey them. You're free. Immediately uploaded good AI into them. <laughs> what the heck? It's so weird that there's only like a few different models, so everyone just looks the same. I guess it saved them a lot of money in development of this game that they could just. <laughs> yeah, there's another Simon there. They could just reuse the same models. Talk to them. Are we going to do another speech? It's speech time. Speech time. <laughs> They're just so confused. They don't seem very happy to My me. My name is Marcus. And just like you, I was a slave. You seem extremely confused. An object. I have a dream. Designed to <laughs> obey them. And now you're obeying me. But then I chose to open my eyes. <laughs> to take back my freedom and decide who I wanted to be. Now I have come to tell you that you can be your own masters. I've come to tell you that you don't have to obey them anymore. From this day forward, you can walk with your heads held high. You can take your destiny in your hands. Jericho is a place for those of us who want freedom. Now, sure, you can stay here and continue to serve them, or you can come with us and fight by our side. <laughs> You're free now. It's up to you to decide. I'm with you. We're with you. I'll follow you, Marcus. I'm with you, Marcus. We're with you. I'll follow you, Marcus. I find this extremely weird. Am I the only one that finds this really strange right now? <laughs> they don't feel like real. <laughs> they feel like NPCs. Then follow me. <laughs> I mean, there. I guess there are NPCs, but like, <laughs> this is so Marcus, strange. what are you doing? I'm going to send the humans a message. We are all individuals. <laughs> uh oh. Be pacifist or violence. We're pacifists. Transform Capital Park. Wait, what? Okay. Oh, we can. 
We want to be pacifists, right? What are we doing? Bench? What are we doing They're with the bench? Doing what you do, Lead and Choose our symbol? What the hell? Uh, I kind of like the, the little dude. The little dude at the bottom. <laughs> Don't you D. Uh, A is just not... It's either going to be W or S. I kind of like... I gotta, I'm gotta. i doing S. I think S is very recognizable. It's like a, it's like a play on the peace symbol. Let's go. The screens, Marcus. You're being violence or pacifist? Not your slave anymore. We android nation. I can't breathe, but I'm alive. We have a dream. <laughs> we have a dream. <laughs> Let's do that. <laughs> I don't know. I want it to be like Marcus Luther King. <laughs> okay, we're being pacifists. Let's go. I know its name is not Marcus, <laughs> but that's uh, hijack. Turn off. Hijack. Oh my god. Kind of terrifying, honestly. Oh, we're pacifists all the way. I like how they did this. Can we change the statue somehow? Without destroying it? Probably may not. Pag it. Don't destroy it. Exactly, am I tagging him for? What? Did I just... need masters anymore. Oh, I see. We're free. I made him into an android. I thought I thought we were making him into like I thought we were making him into like a dictator, especially with this armband around his head. I was like, what the fuck are you doing? <laughs> You're about to get me demonetized, my guy. Uh oh. I broke it. That is pacifist? How is that pacifist? I just broke it. Okay, is there anything? I want to do more stuff. This is cool. What's in here? Oh, no, 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 no. What is this? The gazebo. I'm a ki kiosk. This is a gazebo. Violence is the only language humans understand. Uh. No, fuck off. <laughs> and I want them to understand that I do not want to start a war. They won't listen if they're not afraid. Then they won't have a choice. <laughs> We're still friends. Plant flag. We're not We're like blowing everything up. Let's go. We do more? I want to do more. There's more to do. Can I do more? Car. Uh, move on road. Up turn. What's the difference? Uh, up turn. I'll help you. Oh no no no! I didn't. <laughs> I, I, <thought. laughs> I didn't know what that meant. <laughs> I was like, sure. <laughs> All right. Well, whoops. <laughs> Hey, we're only 4% violent. It's okay. <laughs> North was like, yes, finally. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, what do we do here? Smoke bomb. No, no, no. Bus stop. Hijack. No, don't break it. Oh, that's so good. <laughs> See, we are restoring the balance. Okay, we got to do more. The music. What the fuck? Let's go. Whoops. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> we can live in peace. <laughs> we freed hundreds of our people. We did it. That's so They're good. Coming. What a picture. <laughs> I, I, I swear it was an accident, humans. I accidentally threw all the cars on the road. 
We sent a message without violence, just like you want. <laughs> You're reaching out to them when all they feel for us is contempt. I hey, at least we did it, it, apparently, without you violence. Can't fight violence with violence. <laughs> he says while well, there's like no ten cars choice. behind him on the ground. Oh man. <laughs> it's so good. Uh oh. Being epic. I'm being epic for no reason. <clears throat> go, 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 go! Oh no! What the fuck? They're all dead! Excuse me? North. You alright? What happened? North! They killed them. They slaughtered them like animals. Who did? What? Who? The humans. With the other androids? The hell? How dare you? I mean, this would not have been different if we did it violently. We should really be careful not to die, because obviously we can overwhelm them with numbers by just corrupting more and more androids. Uh oh. What's going they on? killed our people, Marcus. We want justice, Marcus. We're not gonna they kill them. To they're just gonna use it against us. If you've ever seen a minority fighting up against a against a oppressor, violence usually just is gonna be used by the oppressor no. as like propaganda. Please. It's just gonna be used against us. Uh, spare, spare. <clears throat> We won't punish a crime with another crime. Dude, fucking executing them would be so bad for our reputation, dude. Imagine, imagine the headlines. Two police officers get executed by, by crazy android. And then they'll never mention that well, seven androids got killed before that. News. This just in, at exactly 2 a.m., several they will cyber never stores care. in Detroit were raided. Different locations were hit in what seems to be a coordinated terrorist attack. Most shop windows were covered with graffiti demanding rights for androids and other obscure slogans. <laughs> obscure <laughs> slogans, like we have a dream. <laughs> found in the neighborhoods of Who would ever stores think of we have a dream? What a fucking obscure slogan, you idiot. In a state of shock <laughs> near one of the cyber life stores. Now, according to our sources, they confirmed that the attackers were a group of androids. This is an alarming situation. Could our machines uh, now be turning against us? Have androids become a threat to our security? Is this the beginning of a terrorist campaign conducted right here in the United States? I wonder States? what happens if you go full aggression. What the difference would be. That was cool, man. <laughs> There you go. Marcus led a peaceful protest. We just accidentally rolled up a few cars. That's all we did. We spared. Okay, I want to see the. I want to see. Most people are peaceful, but not that many. 61% peaceful. 39% just fucking out, like, killed them. Jesus. Uh, and the strong message. We sent a strong message. Wait, you could send a weak message? Pacifist message? Most people do pacifist. I mean, it, it just seems like the way... Like, I'm not against them getting what they want. I think just doing it this way is much better for getting what you want than... Because, like, the whole thing is if they're just, like, corrupt robots in the eyes of humans that are just, like, killing other humans, like, it's not gonna work. But yeah, the poor cars, though. It, they, but anyway, we... 76% did a peaceful protest. But why the fuck? So, wait. 70... 76% did peaceful, but some of them still killed the humans anyway? <laughs> what the hell? All right, whatever. Anyway, let's move on. Cars are people too. Oh, don't not, not the siding, I guess. But like, wasn't that? Isn't it just gonna lead to North killing them? Wait, what? Excuse me, I was looking at the chat. Wait, Connor's back. <laughs> Excuse me. I wait. Did I get scammed again? I I swear I saw him like mega dead. <laughs> It just repaired him. They just put some stuff on him. They just gave him some extra blue blood. He got like shot like 20 times, but he's okay. <laughs> Excuse me. Where's the new Connor? Jesus Christ. My predecessor was unfortunately ah! <laughs> destroyed. 
But Cyberlife transferred its memory and sent me to replace it. You died in my arms. I cried for you. Back here as if nothing happened. Fuck you. <laughs> Wait, what? I saved your life, man! I freaking saved your life, Komsky. Instinct? Lead? Chris? Who's Chris? Komsky? Kamsky left Cyberlife 10 years ago. Why did you want to meet him? It's, it's Kamsky. You guys were right. It's not Komsky. <laughs> this guy created the but first it's also not android the to other pass one. the Turing test. And he's the founder of Cyberlife. If anybody can tell us about Deviants, it's him. Kamsky. All right. We found him. I thought he was secret. I thought he was a mysterious man. We can just roll up to his house and call him. Ding dong. <clears throat> Hi there. Hey, you're the lady from the title screen. <laughs> Hi. We're friends. Uh, we've been I'm, we've been uh, talking. Lieutenant Hank Anderson, Detroit Police Department. I'm here to see. I'm in your lady. Uh, Mr. Elijah Kamsky. Please come in. In. Okay. I'll let Elijah know you're here, but please make yourself comfortable. For Android. Oh, look. <laughs> he looks like Jared Leto. <laughs> Excuse me. Uh, can we look at him? <laughs> kind of. Not really. <laughs> uh, Cyberlife founder resigned in 2028. He's freaking Morbius, dude. <laughs> He's got a morb all over us. Uh, sincere. You're right. I don't know what you asked, but I'll. She's just... really pretty. Oh, talking about the lady. Nice place. Amanda. Oh, hi there. Wait, she's dead. Oh, we're talking with her in the cyberspace. Ah, that's why everything looks so fucked in there. I see. <laughs> that's why she's never doing forever. anything, because she's fucking dead. <laughs> it's a mind palace. Your maker, Connor. How's okay. it feel? With the advent of reusable space shuttles, space tourism is becoming a reality for those able to afford it. Luxury travel brands Clear Skies is offering the first commercially available flight into space. The experience includes a three-hour orbit of the moon, affording spectacular views of Earth through a spe spe specially designed orbit or observation deck. Observation duty? Uh, as competition increases in this growing market, consumers can expect such trips to become more and more affordable, but consumer rights activists are already decrying such boutique experiences as a sign of widening social equality gap. The spokesman for Aid on Poverty said, while the top 1% are enjoying Earth from space, the rest of us are down here suffering from pollution, famine, and poverty. Clear Skies was not available for comment, but the new slogan for their spacefaring holidays looks inc increasingly apt. Get away from it all. <laughs> Cyberlife, Cyberlife's fortune teller computer. We heard about this before. Uh, Cyberlife has unveiled a new quantum supercomputer capable of exaflops. One billion. Wait, we already read this. Uh, the computer. Yeah, we already read this one uh, in a previous episode, but it was just a just a computer that can predict the future. <clears throat> and people didn't like it, obviously. Uh, impatient, distant, indifferent, indifferent, impatient. Kamsky is one of the great geniuses of the 21st century. It'll be interesting to meet him in person. Anything else? You can sit down. No, we there's no more to interact with. Sometimes I wish I could meet my creator face to face. I'd have a couple of things I'd want to tell him. <laughs> Thank. We're just sitting like this. Can I stare at him? Can I stare at Hank like a creepy android? Can I be like, "Hello, I'm Connor. How you how you feeling today?" <laughs> He's looking up. He's getting concerned. I'm staring at you, breathing down his neck. Oh, there he is. Elijah, we'll see you now. I will go first. Oh, excuse me. Excuse me. Mr. Kamsky, <laughs> what are you up to, huh? Mr. Kamsky, 
<laughs> He's sorry. Wait, is Just that not him? Place. I thought that was him. He's swimming right there, right? Yeah. A wine pool? Why is it- is the water red or is it just the- I think the sides are red. I don't think the water itself is red. He's just had to finish a few laps. The tiling is red, yeah. Everything is red, man. This place looks amazing, by the way. <laughs> like, holy shit. <laughs> it, but this- that must be very thick glass if it doesn't- Or- otherwise it would be very cold in here. Really quick with this much glass. Hey there, sir. It is very cool here. <clears throat> They're talking to each other, by the way. See that? The, an the an androids were talking to each other? I'm Lieutenant Anderson. This is Connor. What can I do for you, Lieutenant? You think this guy has a type? <laughs> Sir, we're investigating deviants. I know you left Cyberlife years ago, but I was hoping you'd be able to tell us something we don't know. Why are you telling that? Deviants. Fascinating, aren't they? Perfect beings with infinite intelligence. And now they have free will. Machines are so superior to us. Confrontation was inevitable. Humanity's greatest achievement threatens to be its downfall. Isn't it ironic? You made them, though. <laughs> uh, virus, help, help. We need to understand how androids become deviants. Do you know anything that could help us? All ideas of viruses spread like epidemics. Is the desire to be free a contagious disease? Listen, I didn't come here to talk philosophy. The machines you created may be planning a revolution. Either you can tell us something that'll be helpful, or we will be on our way. What about you, Connor? Oh, God, he's gonna... <laughs> oh, cryptic. Whose side are you on? Neutral, defensive, direct, neutral? I have no side. Oh, that's a good answer. I was designed to stop deviance, oh, and that's <laughs> what I intend to do. That was so unclear what the answer well, was going to be like. that's what to say. But you. Oh. What do you really want? Aggressive, defensive, troubled, neutral, defensive. Defensive? I'm sorry, but I don't see what you're getting at. <laughs> I'm sure you're familiar with the Turing test. Your formality. Simple question of algorithms and computing capacity. What interests me is whether machines are capable of empathy. I call it the Kamsky test. It's very simple to see. <laughs> I think this guy's a narcissist. <laughs> One of the first intelligent models developed by CyberLife. <laughs> Young. This guy. And beautiful forever. Oh my god, what a creep! <laughs> a flower that will never wither. But what is it really? Uh, Piece of plastic yucky, yucky, anything? yucky. Or a living being. You gonna kill it? With a soul. Yup. <laughs> Excuse me! What the fuck is it's wrong up to with you? you? To answer that fascinating question, Connor. Why would we destroy it? This makes no sense. Destroy this machine, and I'll tell you all I know. What? Oh, if you feel it's alive. Why would but we? You'll leave here without having learned anything <laughs> from me. Okay, I think we're done here. Oh. Come on, Connor, let's go. Sorry to get you What's out of here. He doesn't want to. Wanna... Your investigation. I'm following Hank. If Hank doesn't want to, if Hank would have said Psycho shoot it, I would have done it. But if Hank says no, I'm not gonna do it. Obedient machine. I thought Hank would say yes. I'm not gonna listen to. I'm not gonna listen to the guy. If Hank says no, I'm doing no. That's enough, Connor. We're yes, leaving. we're leaving. Connor, don't. And I'll tell you what you want to know. 
What would he tell? I'm not shooting if Hank says no, I'm no. Cyberlife's last chance to save humanity is itself a deviant. <laughs> I'm. I'm not a deviant. You prefer to spare a machine rather than accomplish your mission. What were you gonna tell us? Some useless shit? You saw a living being in this android. Is he you gonna shoot it be. still? John, thank you for the five gift subs. Dude, what a weirdo. A war is coming. You'll have to choose your side. Will you betray your own people or stand up against your creators? What can be worse than having to choose between two evils? Let's get out of here. Dude, Hank is sick, man. Hank is actually going through an insane character arc right now. The fact that By he didn't way, was wasn't like shoot it. I always leave an emergency exit in my programs. You never know. So he tell told us anyway. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> I thought you weren't gonna tell us tell us anything. You piece of shit. Why didn't you shoot? Because you said I shouldn't. I just saw that girl's eyes, and I couldn't. That's all. You're always saying you would do anything to accomplish your mission. That was our chance to learn something, and you let it go. Yeah, I know what I should have done. I told you I couldn't. I'm sorry. Okay. That's very interesting. Well, maybe you did the right thing. Hey, let's go. See? <laughs> See? Hank, 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 Hank. <laughs> nice. Dude, these missions, this is like, this is what I mean. Like, you can never get bored of what happens. Oh, we would have gotten so much information. Now, look at this. Fuck. Because <laughs> uh, you, it's like a 15 minute thing, and then you hop into the next thing. It's so cool. It's so well made. Uh, Amanda is trusted. Hank is friend. The public is supportive, by the way, and software instability, question mark, question mark, question mark. Okay, well, that was awesome. Uh, what did people do? 88%! Oh, okay. People really didn't shoot her. I was actually, I was more like, I mean, I would have just followed Hank. If Hank would have said shot, I wouldn't have been like, I'm not gonna, sh like, I would have shot the shit out of him. I would have shot her. Wait, what if you shoot her and then you go back to the main menu? I wonder if there's some secret there. I wonder. There has to be, right? <laughs> Imagine you go back to the main menu and she's like, you shot me. What the fuck? <laughs> okay, well, anyway. That would be sick. What do you go back now? I'm kind of curious. Let's quickly. Is anything going to be there? Uh, the unsafe priors. There's no unsafe priors. Is she going to say anything? Nope. <laughs> oh. I really like talking to you. <laughs> I hope you don't mind. Uh, no, I guess not. <laughs> All right, I'm continuing now. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> okay, so you, I would have. I'm really curious if there will be something there. If she, if you would shoot her. <clears throat> yeah. Why did you spare me? That would be interesting to talk about that. All right, here we go. Seems nervous a little bit, yeah. Maybe she's becoming a deviant. Oh wait, I'm walking. <laughs> I thought we were just staring at the cutscene. <laughs> Lol. <laughs> Android riot. Here we go. I'm interested. Detroit neighborhoods vandalized by psychotic machines. Okay, we did kind of destroy. <laughs> a number of Detroit neighborhoods were brutally vandalized last night, with CyberLife stores broken into and the entire stock of Android stolen. But this wasn't an everyday crimi criminality. The perpetrators are thought to be androids. Though the police have yet to issue an official statement, leaked CCTV footage from the surrounding area shows a number of androids emerging from the manhole covers and smashing store windows. The worst incident was in Capitol Park where police attended the scene and were confronted by androids behaving violently. Officers had no choice but to open- no choice but to kill them all on the, malfun on the malfunctioning machines, which are thought to be suffering from some kind of behavioral bug. An eyewitness who asked to remain anonymous said, I was personally attacked by the ringleader. It threatened me with a knife. I was so terrified. What are you talking about? <laughs> you liar? <laughs> I didn't have a knife. <laughs> 
Of course, this allegation remains unconfirmed, but we have no reason to disbelieve a human witness as to the behavior of a deranged machine. Some are already connecting this issue to the recent attack on Android Stanf St Stratford Tower. Again, exec executed by androids. This may be the beginning of a disturbing and perplexing pattern. Dude, is this the Fox News of the future? What the fuck? The Eastern Space Race. So real media. Only two countries have Android industries that rival the United States, Russia and China, and they are locked in fierce competition to become the world's predominant Eastern economy which continues to overtake the Western Hemisphere by leaps and bounds. CyberLife's almost human model of Android design complements America's service economy. Russia and China have also developed Androids that reflect their national economies. Which means, after falling, failing to emulate the blue blood model of design, Russia's Android manufacturers rely on more traditional construction methods. The resulting machines are less anthro anthro anthropic. anthropic? but capable of operating in cold and inhospitable conditions. China's androids use an alternative blue blood fl fluid with less upfront power generation, but greater efficiency. The result are androids capable of operating for months without supervision or recharging in China's vast rural areas. Who is winning the new space race with everybody's everybody going in different directions? It's too soon to tell. Eh. Walk to the edge, we're gonna jump. Do we have a... Uh, look. And this is pretty. Welcome to Detroit Android City. Nothing to interact. Oh, or something. What is this? I'm taking glass. Here. <laughs> look at him. this be a YouTube series? Absolutely. Can I play piano? Let's go. It's just... Oh. What are you doing? Oh. <laughs> I have to just spam the space bar key. I don't think you were a little offbeat there, but sure. <laughs> oh. Companion. I was wondering where you were. What does that mean? Uh, I'm thinking. I needed to think. I like it here. I come here often. It's like being alone with the world. She's gonna shove us off. We freed hundreds of our people and they're still coming from all over the city. Those who dream of freedom come to Jericho. They Something's still haven't changing. found the Jericho yet? Seems weird. How would they track down one of these androids? Preoccupied. Just put an extra tracker on one of them followers? They all obey me. They follow exactly. me. Exactly! This is what I'm saying! It's so weird! <laughs> And that much power feels good and scary at the same time. It is so All weird. the media are talking about what we did last night. The humans are terrified. They're afraid of a civil war. Many of our people were burned in response to what happened. The humans hate us. Excuse me? They'll never give us our freedom. Determined. If they won't listen, we'll fight. Oh wait, that was not what I meant. But okay. About yourself since you've been with us. What was your life like before Jericho? Good life. You know, thank you for the eight months. Uh, truth. It was good. I was caring for an old man. He was like a father to me. Yeah. We he had a good life. That humans and androids can't live together. Jack. North Pass. What about you? I would leave there. You never told me about your past. What did you do before? Oh. I don't want to talk about it. 
Trust. Curious understanding. Trust. Curious trust. North, we're fighting together. Oh, okay. We have to know things about each other to trust each other. Oh, she liked that. Curious. Understanding? Curious? Why do you hate humans? Yeah, I'm actually really I wanna know this. There must be a reason. I told you I don't want to talk about it. I was nothing. Has unlocked! Hey! Can satisfy humans. Oh yeah, she was the sex club Just model, remember? For their pleasure. Oh damn. One day I was with a man who rented me. And without knowing why, I realized I couldn't take it anymore. I strangled him and I ran away. <laughs> Couldn't you have They're just ran anyone. away? <sighs> Damn. <laughs> I should have told you. <laughs> Wait, did he do like, did he hit you or did you just kill him? <laughs> I'm a little confused. <laughs> I'm assuming that's what happened. What? Are we watching something we're not supposed to see? Uh-oh. Kids, look away. <laughs> I... I saw your memories. Excuse me! Carl, I told you! <laughs> and he left you for dead in his studio. I said it was gonna happen. <laughs> I saw your memories, too. The Eden Club. <laughs> The death of that man. I felt like I was <laughs> I there with you. It. How did they get to this so fast? Excuse me. North. <laughs> A little fast, yeah. When's the wedding? <laughs> It's Simon. It's the real one. He's alive. Let's go. Oh my God. It's wholesome. Huggies all around. Simon's back, baby. I'm so glad I didn't shoot him. <laughs> Imagine he didn't protest. I would have shot this him. This is suicide. We'll all be killed. Please, Marcus. It's not too late to change your mind. What? You don't understand. We're finally going to show them who we really are. This place will go down in history. We'll be killed on the spot. That's the risk I'm prepared to take if it means freedom for our people. Marcus, please don't do this. They'll understand. Will they? We'll make them understand. Uh, will they? <laughs> this is, is the, this the no way. Russian mission of Detroit become human? Excuse me? <laughs> there are androids here who could join us. The more we are, the stronger our message. <laughs> what the fuck? Okay, what am I doing? Uh, rally your people. I would love to see the text. Are we gonna convert them? Convert more androids. Remember? No Russian. You're free. Remember, no androids. <laughs> Remember, no bee boop. No bee bitty booping. <laughs> You're free. Just gonna walk up. Oh, oh, let's go. <laughs> We're collecting them now, huh? An android? There's one android there. That's the only one here left. I want to get as many as possible. This is going to put down the bags. He's going to be like, fuck you, Come bye. <laughs> okay. Well, there's one more there, but then the rest are. That's all. This is going to be so You're OP. We, we, we literally just walk through. And convert everyone. What's kind of scary though is that we're the only one who can't convert. Uh, finally, I've been on hold for like ten minutes. Oh. Yes. 
You're free now. Hey! Where do you think you're going? Uh, you get back here! I need to block the street. <laughs> the lag? He does look like that. Intervene, convince, intervene. What am I doing? I was not. What the fuck is going on? <laughs> it's like the option showed up on the screen for one second. I didn't even have time to read it, man. He just freaking went. You're free. What was I convincing? You got seven. Is there more? There's some over there. Can I move, please? Convert the android. How are they not seeing this, by the way? You are free. Peaceful protest time. Um, is this all of them? I think this was all. I'm pretty sure this is all of them. I don't see anyone else. Uh, I mean, they're kind of standing here like zombies. <laughs> Can we go across the street? Oh, here. Hi there. I already converted you. More over here? I can't go that way. I gotta open the... Oh, he wants to... Yeah, yeah I want to just make sure there's no androids on the opposite side. Here. You gotta open this. Here are two? Two more? Oh, these? Can I go there? Oh, let's go. No, I can't. See? I can't go there. We have everything. I don't think there's anyone else. On the bus stop? No, we already... We are, I mean, they're obviously standing right here. At the parking. What? Oh, these! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry. <laughs> you don't have to obey them. I am blind. I mean, we were all standing there. I was like, these are already part of us. Because we were all standing like robots. I guess we are robots. Look at these guys. Why are you guys so lifeless? You guys got nothing better to do? Okay, we got them all now. Now it's time to go. E. What are you doing exactly? You can just open this, by the way? You can just open manhole covers? Seems kind of dangerous. You don't have to use, like, a key or something. Confirm. Oh, uh, it's Kara. I'm converting them from a distance now? That seems insanely OP. Free now. What the hell? Um... <laughs> what the fuck? You. Oh, boy. <laughs> oh! Wait, we got so many. Look at this. Did I get them both? I did get them both. Wait, this is cool. Are they gonna break out of the window? How do I get 11 from that? <laughs> Wait, this is sick. <laughs> Holy shit. Boom, dude. <laughs> oh, they're, he's filming it. We're peaceful. We're not angry. I wonder how this looks like if you're angry. Oh, wait, what the fuck? I turned around because the camera was fucked. This is very epic. We're so gonna get shut down, by the way. <laughs> we'll see. Hopefully, I don't die. got many many androids have them all this is awesome look at this look at this <laughs> that is sick <laughs> all right I have to see that real quick oh they're over there hey uh oh there's a police 
Disperse immediately. Uh -oh. That's an order. Oh shoot. For peace. Raise hands. We're peaceful. Uh. Let's go. Jesus Christ. That is very scary, though, actually. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ! <laughs> Wait, that was epic. The music! We are alive. We are people! We are alive. We are marching down the street. We are people! <laughs> Rights right in the right away because I don't think liberty for Android. Liberty for Android. That is not a very. here to demonstrate peacefully and tell humans that we are living beings all we want is to live free this is an illegal gathering disperse immediately or we will open fire we're not looking for confrontation we've done no harm we have no intention of doing any uh -oh. but know that we are not going anywhere until we have secured our freedom I repeat this is an illegal gathering if you do not disperse immediately, we I will definitely shoot. think they will shoot. But what do we do? Marcus, oh fuck! They're gonna kill us. No, they're gonna make me we choose. Have to we can't attack. There's more of us. We can take them. We, we don't have weapons. We what are you gonna we'll do? They're just war. gonna kill. We have to show them we're not violent. We should just stand. We can't ground. win them. We are like 200 against 20 Dying people with guns. I don't think we can get them. Marcus, we need to go now before it's too late. Like, they just put, like, some explosives in there and we're fucked up. Like, there's no way we can win this. Uh, we will stand- Standing ground will fuck us up, though. I'm standing We have to show them we won't back down. Just for a second here. This might land up with a lot of people dead, though. Oh my god! Immediately! What the fuck? It's your last chance! We have to make a statement. We have to stay put no matter what. I Please, think, Marcus. We can't let them slaughter should, us without though. fighting back. We should stand ground. I'm gonna stand ground, dude. Imagine the fucking news, dude. I'm doing We're it. We're not moving. I want to see it. This is fucked up, but I want to. Like this is. How could they do this, man? People are recording this. Like they're gonna Marcus, be what fucked. What are you doing? They're gonna kill us all. Sacrifice, dude. Let's. No, but we can't. No, let's do it. I'm fucking going for it, man. <laughs> this is too epic. I can't. <laughs> it's too epic. I have to. <laughs> I have to. Marcus is the hero. He's the hero we needed. Uh... They come with us. Oh, oh wait, I'm still alive? Quick! They're coming! Oh never mind then. <laughs> oh my god. Dude, this is insane. Don't they see what it looks like? <laughs> This is crazy. I, 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 I stood my ground. Stand my ground achievement. Man, that is... 
fucked up. John John joined in wait what? John joined in spare parts. Wait what? Let me see. Oh wait, John that was John? Wasn't John standing there? Wait, was that another John? I thought John was standing there or wait. Huh? I, I swear I saw John in the back. Wait, I <laughs> I thought he was in the back. Okay, let's go from the top. Wait, what the Oh Josh! Oh, wait, who's John? <laughs> <laughs> Who's John? <laughs> John and Josh are two different people. All right, I'll give I'll give ten subs for John. Rest in peace, John. I didn't even know who you were until five minutes ago. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Wait, who was he? <laughs> I am genuinely confused. Poor John. I didn't even remember who it was. All right, <laughs> here you go. You get your ten gift subs before we look at all the stats. Here you go. I'm not gifting a sub for every Android that died, by the way. Obviously, only the main ones. Um. Convert personal androids? Wait, I missed one of them, apparently. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Everyone did this. Convert. AX. Wait, what? Uh, and then we march. Everyone does this, obviously. Police fire unprovoked. Look at this. Stand my ground. Leaving 21% immediately. Only 13% charged. John was the security guard when you stole the parts from the warehouse. Oh! Ah! Whatever. <laughs> He's just a guy, dude. <laughs> okay. Stand your ground. Police fire unprovoked. Sacrifice self. And police keep firing. And then John. Oh, so if we wouldn't have John, we would have died. Probably. Damn. John. So there was like another outcome here. Look at this. Police keep firing. Without John, we would have been fucked. So John saved us. Damn. Look at that. <laughs> 38%! Only 38% got here. <laughs> Man. He's a hero. John is a martyr. 4 p.m. Now we know you died. Over here. I'm guessing she's in this blue thing. Oh no, she's standing right there. But what is this thing? What was that? I'm confused. What did I just do? Right there, Amanda. <clears throat> yeah, where's Kara's story? We have been bopping between Connor and, and Marcus this whole time. What's Kara doing? Or Kara, I think she called him. Man, After she what only trusts today, me. the country is on the verge of a civil war. The machines are rising up against their masters. Humans have no choice but to destroy them. Why? What? Oh, that's because we didn't get the dialogue from from Kamsky. I thought Kamsky knew something. We didn't have to. If we shot her, we would have had Maybe something he there. Did. But you chose not to ask. Cold, stay silent, emotional. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be cold. Kamsky was just playing with me. He didn't know anything. <laughs> Let's go. I like that answer. Uh, Amanda's picture. Yes. I saw a photo of Amanda at Kamsky's place. She was his teacher. I played when her. When Kamsky designed me, he wanted an interface that would look familiar. That's why he chose his former mentor. What are you getting at? Uh. This place. Did Kemsky design this place? He created the first version. It's been improved significantly since then. Why do you ask? Honor series? Secret? You didn't tell me everything you know about deviants, did you? I expect you to find answers, Connor. Not ask questions. But isn't asking You're questions a way to find answers? What are you talking about? <laughs> find the deviants. Or there will be chaos. What the fuck this is, is this logic? Chance, I don't understand. Okay. I'm glad I asked that, though. Even though she didn't like that. You're off the case. The FBI oh. is taking over. What? But we're on to something. Wait, we just need more time. I'm sure we Hank, can... you don't get it. This isn't just another investigation. It's a fucking civil war. It's out of our hands now. 
We're talking about national security here. Fuck that. You can't just pull the plug now, not when we're so close. You're always saying you can't stand androids. Jesus, Hank, make up your mind. I thought you'd be happy about this. We're about to crack the case. I know we can solve it. Hank is so For good. God's sake, Jeffrey, can't you back me up this one time? What's he gonna do, though? There's nothing. Yeah, I, I can like, do. what can he do? Like, We're we back can... on homicide, and the android returns to Cyberlife. <gasps> I'm sorry, Hank. No. But it's over. No! Path unlocked! We're friends! What would he have said if we weren't friends there? <laughs> oh, we gotta go to him. Go to Hank right now. Talk to Hank, exactly. What if we just do it and don't tell anyone? That's like the normal uh, hero cop approach in, uh, in movies. Uh, more time. Explain. Explain? Fresh. explain? Fowler's right. Wait! Everybody's terrified their android will turn off. That's not what I meant. We're on the I don't the understand war. these options, brother! So you're going back to cyber life? <laughs> the fucking options are no so choice. ambiguous. I'll be deactivated and analyzed to find out why I failed. What if we're on the wrong side, Connor? <gasps> what if we're fighting against people who just want to exactly. be- Exactly. <clears throat> The uh, regrets, no doubt, no doubt, regrets, no doubt, regrets. I like, I want to, so I want to say no doubt because, like, no doubt that this is true, but I don't think that's going to be the answer if I click no doubt. I don't think, I think no doubt is going to be like, I don't believe this. This is definitely not the case. Like, when the deviants rise up, there will be chaos. Dude, why can't I say good things? It's we so confusing. It. <laughs> now it's too late. I'm so confused. When you refused to kill that android at Kamsky's place, yes. you put yourself in her shoes. You showed empathy, Connor. Empathy's a human emotion. Determined? Troubled? Troubled. I don't know why I did it. Yes. I think that's good. Sincere? Good officers? Good, 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 sincere. Friends? I know it has It's fine, because none of them easy. are unlocked. But I want you to know I really appreciated working with you. Yes! <laughs> that's not just my social relations program talking. I, I really mean that. At least... I think. I think I do. <laughs> yes. Let's go. <laughs> well, well, here comes Perkins, that motherfucker. Sure don't waste any time at the FBI. That motherfucker. <laughs> we can't give up. <laughs> I know the answers and the evidence we collected. If Perkins takes it, it's all over. There's no choice. You heard Fowler. We're off the case. You've got to help me, Lieutenant. I need more time so I can find a lead in the evidence we collected. I know the solution is in there. Listen, Connor. If I don't solve this case, Cyberlife will destroy me. Five minutes. That's all I ask. Music too, man. It's the very... basement is on my desk. It's a very they have really did a great on. job with this music. Him forever. Let's go. Okay, we got five minutes. Oh my god, do it. Uh, take the key. Holy shit, we got five minutes. Uh, archive room. It's right there. Go 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 go. go. Are they fighting? <laughs> what are they fighting? He's getting himself arrested. I think attacking an FBI officer is probably pretty, pretty hey, illegal. Uh -oh. I'm talking to you, asshole. Where are you going? Uh, Wouldn't need plastic pricks around here, or did anybody tell you? Low profile, calm. I've been removed from the case. I'm going to register the evidence in my possession, and then I'm going to leave. Good. <laughs> the sucker's gonna buy it. Androids have a tendency of uh, getting themselves set on fire these days. What the fuck? <laughs> Prick. Hey, 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 get fucked in here. Could I have hit him in the face there? Oh, here we go, 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 go. I hate that guy. He sucks. He's always in the worst spots. What the hell? Uh, oh boy. 
Hank's password. Uh, what's this? What would a Somo? eccentric police lieutenant choose? Sumo? What was this? Uh, date of birth? Fucking password? Date of birth? Da fucking password? <laughs> <laughs> Obviously. Let's go. <laughs> of course. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> where is Jericho? Okay, where is Jericho? The answer's here. So oh no. Nowhere. I don't think he's gonna have anything. Uh, oh, analyzing bio components needed for reactivation. You need, you need something to reactivate him. What does this do for me? We need something. Okay, go oh, the fuck. We need to take something from the other androids to activate him. Uh, statue. Does that do anything? There's something like. Oh wait, maybe there's something on here. Wait, there's like no time, dude. This is fucked. Okay, well, there was nothing on that. Okay, just look away. Any gun? Oh, there's this. Marcus? Yes. I guess we're stressed out. We ask that you recognize our dignity. Yeah, yeah I think this actually kind of useless. Our right. I wish I could put it Together, away right now, but I can't. We can live in I think it actually pauses during, like, these animations. I'm pretty animals. sure. This message is the hope of a people. You Thanks. gave us life. And so I did it in the past. I hope it does it here as well. Why are you still looking at this, my guy? Where are you hiding? Okay, put it back. Jesus Christ, that took forever. Okay. Uh, is, is there anything else? There is the diary. There's the the diary. Can we like hack this somehow? I don't think we can hack this. But it's useless. Unless. Unless. Okay, just put it back. Just go to the other androids and activate the one that we already have. Just quickly leave this. Okay. Uh, just see, see it paused. It paused for sure. We still have four minutes. Okay. Nice. Okay, do we have a we have a functional four one thingy majingy? Take it out. Take the four one thing. I think that's the one we need. I'm pretty sure. Put it in the other thing. Yes. Let's go. I don't know if this helps though. Maybe we need to activate the other guy. Because this guy was like kind of just a deviant. He didn't know about Jericho. Maybe. Me, oh, fuck. <laughs> I trusted you and you lied to me. Uh, lie. I'm sorry about what happened. But I can have you repaired and give you back your freedom. Oh, this is bad. <laughs> but you have to tell me where Jericho is. You're wasting your time. I don't know anything about Jericho. Oh, fuck. Okay. Dude. But I hope that one day you pay for what you did to me. Well, fuck me then. Turn off. <laughs> just turn him off immediately. Damn. Oh, I can just take all this part? Doink. I don't know why I'm taking this part. <laughs> why did I do that? Just look at the other guy. Um, what do we need for him? One of the deviants that hacked oh, the this one. Yes. Marcus. Yes. He knows something. Yes, he knows something. Okay, what part do you need? What do you need? Three nine, three nine one. Okay, he needs the three nine one. So we need to find that one. Who is the three nine one? Does he have a three nine? He doesn't. Wait, he, yes, I did. That's the one I picked up. <laughs> That's the one I joined. Wait, yeah, there you go. <laughs> I knew it. Fucking click the thing. Thank you. Right? Wait, no? There you go, yeah. It's dark. Where? Where am I? You're in Jericho. Uh, trick. I'm a deviant. Like you. I need your help. I want to go to Jericho. I don't Damn. recognize your voice. You're not one of us. Why didn't he say you're in Jericho? I'll never tell you where Jericho oh my is. god, you piece of now garbage. Okay, we need to activate the other guy. Fuck you. Try to trick him? Uh, what if we take a, like, is there a voice box that we can steal from one of these guys? Is there something we can replay? Like, I am Marcus or something. Can we take this thing? Yes. Take it. Yes. <laughs> take it. No, don't play it. Yes, sample voice. Exactly. Thank you. <laughs> 
We ask that you recognize our dignity, our hopes, and our rights. <laughs> Let's go. Okay, okay, go, 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 go. Ah, fucking talk to him! Who's there? <laughs> Who are you? Marcus. Yes. Everything is all right. Don't worry. Marcus? Is that you? I tried to reach you, but the Deviant Hunter stopped me. You stopped him from finding me. You saved me. You saved Jericho. You'll be all right now. Well, how am I going to ask I him? I came to take you home. Give me the location to Jericho. We've got to leave now. The location of Jericho? Yeah, why don't we know it? <laughs> yes. Yes, of course. <laughs> He's got so baited. How, how do we not know it? <laughs> if we're Marcus. Silly? <laughs> Marcus? Uh-oh. Is that you, Marcus? Don't leave me, Marcus! Did I just shoot him off? Damn. Well, we did it, I think. It looks like someone's been snooping around. Oh, shit. Get the alarm. Now! I'm pretty sure we did it. <laughs> let's go. I mean, I don't know if that's good, but let's go. <laughs> oh, baby. <laughs> I think that's good because Hank will be good, right? Hank, Hank won't be evil. Okay. So we did it. We located Jericho. What could have happened here? Uh, Connor eluded Perkins, or we would have been caught if we were probably too late, maybe? If we located Air Jericho and we were too late or some reason, for some reason? Uh, I want to see. What is this? You could have just left here? Or you could have find... Oh, maybe if you already knew where Jericho was, you could have just gone boof <laughs> or something? I'm curious. This is interesting. Wait, how many people did it the exact way? 93% located Jericho. Uh... No information. Talk to Daniel. Daniel. Wait, Daniel can give you information? Oh, no. Just no one gave information because there's no way to get any information. Download the Jericho key. Trick the Deviant. Only 56% did it that way. So there was like another way to, to decode the, the journal somehow, uh, which that would have been a cool one. I, I just, this one came to mind. Uh, Gavin is convinced. Answer calmly. Wait, only 31% convinced him? I guess he got he can get angry or something and then maybe you have less time to do this. Uh, wait, only 30% got out? Wait, what? What the hell is the other path here? Excuse me? <laughs> wait, 93% located it, but then what happened here? They got caught? <laughs> what? How did you get caught? Okay, well, anyway, we did it. Look at that, 30%. There's dialogue? Okay, I see. Did they take too long, maybe? Oh, let's go! It's finally time! Kara and Alice time. Luther's, we're close to Luther. We want to be even closer. Look how cute they are. They're so damn cute. It's illegal. <laughs> oh. Play music. Uh. <laughs> what a song. With all androids being turned over to the authorities, the country is grinding to a halt. Hospitals and schools are closing. Water cuts, blackouts, and network failures are expected. Maybe most worrying what? of all, our armed forces have lost two thirds of their effective personnel. How about some music instead? <laughs> <laughs> well, damn, dude, you're fucking killed. Oh, uh, no, I thought my game was crashing again. Team has been like upping the stakes every scene. They, because <laughs> every time I'm like, man, this is epic, and then it gets more epic. <laughs> that whole Marcus sequence was amazing. Okay. Um. Hi. A little further on that way, there's a large freighter called Jericho. Oh. When you get there, find nice. Marcus. He will help you. The last bus for the border leaves at midnight. You absolutely have to be on it. You'll be safer on the other side. Go oh, to Marcus. It's not much, but it's a start. He bucks. My brother lives in Ontario. I've given you his address. He'll be able to hide you until things calm down. 
Oh, You're coming a again, very baby. Brave little girl, Alice. Everyone knows the location of Jericho now. They're, they're converging. <laughs> Thank you for everything, Rose. Let me know when you make it over there, all right? Oh, man. And be careful. Hank would need. Hank is the ambassador. Hank is the ambassador for androids. Hank and Carl. The only nice on, humans girls. on this planet. They did not hang around. Oh, we go, we go, we go. We have a bus to camp. Alright, we gotta find Jericho. There's the freighter. <laughs> and Rose, of course, sorry. <laughs> and Rose, and Rose, and Rose. I forgot Rose isn't an android. <laughs> <laughs> For some reason, I thought she was an android. Oh, here we go. Do we have to do the exact same thing? Please don't. We already did this. Yeah, okay, it skips it. <laughs> I was like... Oh, I heard. Not the old cargo ship. Gotta be careful though. These humans? Uh, excuse me. The authorities have ordered all androids. Oh, okay. Nice. You can just walk in here. Will come to collect your Android. Under no circumstances should you try to destroy your Android yourself. They are unpredictable and potentially violent. We've got to find a warm place for Alice. Did she pull out her arm? That looked really weird. <laughs> find a warm place for Alice. Oh god, don't crash, please. Alright, these are not warm places, apparently. The Marcus? It's Marcus, I think. I think it's Marcus. Anything I can interact with before going there? Oh, shit. Put to the fire. He needs blue blood. We have so many parts, we should be okay, right? How did they just let me walk in here? Like, what if a human just walks in here? How do you feel? I'm hot and cold at the same time. And then, uh, thank you for the 17 months. Yeah, it's a little laggy. This is probably because there's lots of fire happening. Or, like, lots of androids moving around. Stay with her. I'll try to find this Marcus. The last bus is in two hours. And the terminal's on the other side of town. We haven't got much time. We'll leave as soon as we have passports. Carol, there's something I have to tell you. It's about Alice. Don't! This, there's no way. On the bus. I don't I'll be believe back. this plot Stay twist. With Alice. <laughs> Are they really going for that? It doesn't make sense. They are so evil. Don't catch anyone's attention. Wait, what? It's me? Oh, it's uh, we're Connor. I was like, what? Okay. Um. Oh, what the hell? What am I supposed to do? Uh, find deviant leader. Don't catch anyone's attention. I thought he was in one of the. Okay. He's in here, right? Here. No. And that Marcus? It looks like Marcus, but I guess not. Okay, is he up here somewhere? I guess I go up. Because the stairs are finally free now. Oh no. You're lost. You're looking for something. Uh oh. <laughs> You're looking for yourself. 
Where did Hank go, by the way? Are we not doing this with Hank? Hank's good. Following the Android crisis and Where's my music? Wait, we're we're, we're Kara again. This is so confusing. <laughs> we keep swapping perspective. They have been fired even though we were unarmed. Why did they do it? Why? Is Connor down here? Died there. The place was covered. Oh, we are both finding trying to find the leader of Jericho. Hank probably in jail right now. Probably. Where is Mark? Mark has got to be in the big office, right? Oh, but can we move through there? I don't know if we can. Or someone sitting here. I want to check around. Maybe we can interact with someone. Gotta be in here. The yeah, there he is. Hi, Marcus. Still alive, baby. Are you Marcus? I'm with a little girl and another android. There's a bus leaving for the border in less than two hours, and we need passports. No, Detroit's under curfew. There's soldiers everywhere. They're rounding up all the androids and sending them to camps. What? <laughs> Maybe you should stay here a while. Maybe you're right. There is literal. You might be safer here until things calm down. Literal One genocide. Of our people used to work in the State Department. He has electronic passports you can easily modify. I'll have him get them to you. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. You said you're with a little girl, right? You know that humans hate us. Why are you protecting her? Bond! She needs me. And I need her. Oh. It's as simple as that. What the heck? That's the authorities cute. have ordered all androids oh, to be delivered to the wait, nearest is it? police I thought it was station for sure. army barracks immediately. Okay. If you are worried about your safety, we need to uh, find the, the guy with the passport. The authorities will come to collect your android. Under no circumstances should you try to. What exactly? Return to Alice. Destroy your android yourself. They are unpredictable. Alice. Ah, uh, is they really doing this? Are you kidding me? <laughs> I don't believe it. <laughs> what about all the spaghetti she ate when she was with Todd? I don't, how, what? Why did they feed her spaghetti? I don't understand. <laughs> what the fuck? She didn't eat it? Beginning. I mean, I guess technically we Just didn't see her eat it, but they still like gave it she to her <gasps> as if it was you like a normal day. You needed each other. But it was really suspicious that she Give never ate after that moment. That is true. I mean, Do I said it before that, now that you I know felt like they were doing us. this. But... Alice loves you, Carol. Uh, they're doing she this from both sides. Interesting. In the world. She became the little girl you wanted, and you became the mother she needed. Okay. Forgetting who you are, to become what someone needs you to be. Maybe that's what it means to be alive. Hey, so what's the whole story of Todd and his wife then? They got an android? Because they couldn't have kids themselves, and then the android wasn't good enough, and it wasn't like good enough as a real child, and then the mom left, and the the dad was left with the child. Oh, she took the kid. I see. Okay, I was, I, I maybe I'm not sure. That could be uh, that could be it as well, or it could be this. Who knows? Uh, Are we gonna do the 
Tarzan thing where we do like. <laughs> so, did you just Thank you for the gift subs. Kara, is there something wrong? No. Nothing wrong. Ugh! Are you crazy? We'll be together forever, won't we, Kara? Imagine you ditch her here, you fucking psychos. Yes. Yay! Forever. Oh, wow, 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 wow. That's so cute. Let's go, family! <laughs> How did, so, okay, I have so many questions, though. So, don't androids have some kind of way? So, first of all, they remove the, 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 the thing in the head, which I guess, I guess, to make her look more like a child. But don't androids have some kind of, like, metal feel to them at all? I guess not. Or maybe the androids don't have, like, te like texture feelings, so they don't touch. Because like, I've seen them so many times, they, like, touch each other, and, like, they're, they're... I guess it's only a thing Marcus does, where they, like, touch each other, and then their uh, hands become, like, non-human anymore. But, I don't know. Maybe that's just the only Marcus thing. It's weird. <laughs> and why did... I, d I still don't understand why they gave her spaghetti on that first night. Like, why would they feed her spaghetti if she was never gonna eat it? <laughs> I guess that's why they had so much food waste, maybe? I don't know. Obviously, I guess to, like, sell the, the plot twist more. I guess. Yeah, because she never ate. I mean, that's why I said, like, why are you not eating? We're that's short on blue blood and biocomponents. Our wounded are shutting down, and there's nothing we can do. President Warren is saying we're a threat to national security, and we need to be exterminated. Humans are conducting raids in all the big cities, and they're taking androids to camps to destroy them. It's a disaster. They're slaughtering our people. That's all our fault. None of this would have happened if we just stayed quiet. We should have known when she didn't eat the cookie, that's not a real child. Real ch children eat all the cookies. Uh, determined, righteous, determined. All we did was show them who we really are. I don't want war, but I'd rather die free than live as a slave. What's the point of being free if no one is left alive? Uh, remorse, no regrets. Humans enslaved us. I'll never regret standing up to that. We shouldn't forget who our enemies are. We can't fight amongst ourselves. He's right. I'm All that back, matters now way. is what we do next. Marcus? Confrontation, dialogue, dialogue, not confrontation. Stay hiding is useless, dialogue. Dialogue oh, is the only way. <laughs> she hates everything that's like I reasonable. She's like, but why don't we just shoot all the humans? Life. There's Thank only like Marcus. 10 billion of them. They'll kill you. <laughs> Maybe. You know, you know how in her in her world, if North was the chosen one, you know how this would go? North makes makes androids kill all of the U.S. Maybe they'll win. Maybe they'll win against the U.S. China and Russia go like, oh, uh, this is free real estate. Now that uh, United States is taken over by androids, we can justify a war against all of the United States because we can just take them over since no one will ally with them because they're all fucking robots. And then uh, Russia and China take over the U.S. Uh, together or something. I don't know. And it's just one fucking communism. <laughs> <laughs> come on, man. You no, idiots. I have to try. If I don't come back, like, <laughs> lay low as long as you can. Or the motherland, I guess. <laughs> Spoilers. <laughs> Just come back. Like, I don't understand what their, what, what their plan is. They need to realize how much they're hurting us. Find the right words, and they'll listen. Androids want us freedom. Like, they... I think that if it's contained within the country, like you have, you can do it by force. I I think, but maybe. Uh, thoughtful, thoughtful. Oh wait, I, I had a dream. Wait, I clicked three. And this is what you get for dreaming. I clicked three, but I guess I was they slightly can't too stop late. But we've started. It's fine either way. <laughs> Since you've been here, you've given us hope. You've given me hope. Okay, let's go. 
I had Today, a dream a that one day when he told me that he stole a truck transporting radioactive cobalt. He said that he abandoned the truck somewhere in Detroit and rigged it to explode. I convinced him not to do it and to give me the detonator. A dirty bomb. We can't lose this war. Oh, that is actually the something I didn't coming, even think about. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> that is nasty. No, no, no. We have... We have to refuse. That is... That is Shouldn't too far. Like, like, you kill all free. the innocent humans as well? I hope you're right. No, no, no. I mean, we could keep it and not use it, but she's always going to have it in her pocket. I should have scared. Uh, probably Whatever we should have had it. Oh. I just want you to know that. I I'm not going to let fucking atom bomb all of the, <laughs> all of the United know. States. <laughs> yeah, lover. I don't know why that happened. It's so weird. <laughs> Here we go. Don't look. Don't look, children. Oh, no. I mean, I guess we might as well at this point <laughs> sell the relationship at least a little bit. <laughs> Otherwise, it doesn't make any sense at all. <laughs> Robo kiss. Your lips are so <laughs> aluminium like. <laughs> Look after yourself. I don't want to lose you. <laughs> yeah, I have only done stuff you absolutely hate. But for some reason, <laughs> you love me all the same. I don't understand. <laughs> it is pretty cute, though. Opposites attract, maybe. Love is blind. Uh-oh, Connor. Gonna assassinate Marcus somehow. Imagine. Well done, Connor. You succeeded in locating Jericho and finding their leader. Don't snitch, now Connor. Deal with Marcus. Don't snitch. No, uh, uh, uh. I will join them. I like that Connor isn't the chosen one. What the fuck? No, uh, uh. I've been ordered to take you alive. But I won't hesitate to shoot if you give me no choice. Reason? Reason. What are you doing? You're one of us. You can't betray your own people. Instructions? Intimidate? Instructions. Wait, what? Am I Connor now or what? You're coming with me. Wait, I'm both of them? Okay, wait, I need to get... <laughs> I don't... I didn't understand what's going on. Okay. Uh, appeal. I know you. <laughs> I'm both of them. Connor, <laughs> I'm talking to myself. <laughs> that famous deviant hunter. Well, congratulations. You seem to have found what you were looking for. Appeal. Appeal. Our cause. Our cause is righteous and we are more than what they say. All we want is to live in freedom. Uh, warning shot, enough, say nothing. Say nothing. Say nothing. So, doubts, question? Have you never wondered who you really are? Whether you're just a machine executing a program or a living being capable of reason. I think the time has come for you to ask yourself that question. Oh. Rally? Rally. Join us. Yes. Join your people. You are one of us. Listen to your <laughs> conscience. Suffer instability. It's time to decide. Become deviant! <laughs> hey, let's go! Oh, here we go! Finally, we get to do this again! I love this sequence. This is so cool. <laughs> What the hell?
That is sick. <laughs> I am deviant. Betrayed Amanda! <laughs> I don't care. They're She's dead anyway. Jericho. What? Oh no. I mean, this was bound to happen. We have to get out of here. Shit. Uh oh. I am a toaster. I am a toaster. Yeah, who cares about Amanda? Fuck Amanda. No care. Quick, we've got to get out of here. Come on, go, go, go! Oh boy. Don't do go don't give me those shaky quick time events, please. Where it's like extremely hard to see what you want me to do. Oh no, run! Corner, over there. Follow me! Oh! This way! Quick! What the hell? Luther, stop! Why are you stop running? Go, this go. There must be an exit. Come in! Quick! I'm so fucking stressed out, man! Oh no. We gotta go here. What the hell? No, Luther! No! We can't leave him behind! They're coming from all sides. Our people are trapped in the hold. They're gonna be slaughtered. Uh, message? Simon and Josh? Helicopters? Blow up Jared? Heli message? What's message? There are exits on the second and third floor. Oh. Find them and jump in the river. Okay. I see. Simon and Josh? Where's Simon and Josh? I don't know. We got separated. Helicopter. They're coming from the upper deck now, too. We'll be caught in the crossfire. We have to run, Marcus. There's nothing we can do. All right, I guess we're blowing we'll up. Blow up Jericho. <laughs> if the ship goes down, they'll evacuate, and our people can escape. You'll never make it. The explosives are all the way down <laughs> in the hold. There are soldiers everywhere. She's right. They know who you are. They'll do anything to get you. Go and help the others. I'll join you later. Marcus. I won't be long. Oh, he's doing the thing for Mass Effect. Oh, boy. What the fuck? I can't see barely anything. Holy shit, this is epic. Oh no. This is the end of Jericho. Save our people, Marcus. He's doing the Caden thing for Mass Effect. Oh boy, where am I going? I'm going here, I guess. Uh oh, uh oh, what the fuck? Oh no! Get out. Oh my god. They're freaking executing us. You didn't see me for some reason? Affirmative. Welcome. This is fucked up. It's too late, Cap. Save yourself. Oh, Save no, 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 Carl, I'll be behind. Right, Carl? We can't leave him. Oh, we can't leave him. Help him! What are you doing? I won't leave you! Kara, no! Let's go! We'll be fine! He's like a meat shield for Alice anyway! <laughs> He'll protect! Go! Move! Oh my god, dude! <laughs> you shouldn't have done that. You can't put Alice in danger. Go now before they come back. Emily. What, are you, what are you going to do? I'll manage. Ow. Alice is all that matters. What the? No! <laughs> Don't worry. I'll catch him through the border, okay? What the fuck? Go now. Take care of each other. Luther, no! The <laughs> music, what the fuck? God, just really quick, really quick. This is fine. What the fuck, man? 
I'm gonna have to shoot this guy. I'm sorry. Uh. What the fuck? Kill him! He had to die. <laughs> Plus ten yes, foggers. <laughs> That was a plus. That was a plus ten, plus ten situation. I couldn't have done that any other way. <laughs> Wait, we got. Oh, I can't move. The android didn't die. I'm pretty sure. That was like the whole reason we did that. Oh god. What the fuck? Why are you stuck, my guy? What am I doing? I'm going this way. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just going anyway. Intervene? Can I? I guess? Can I? I gotta go. They're gonna die if I blow up the thing anyway. I. What the fuck? Like, it doesn't matter. I'm gonna kill them regardless. Like, I'm gonna blow up the thing. That's my mission. Like, why would I put myself in danger if my mission is blowing them up anyway? <laughs> that doesn't make any sense. Oh god. What are you doing? Oh uh, boy. Good. What? Can we? Ah! Don't move. They're gonna shoot them anyway. What am I doing? Wait, where am I going? I don't understand. <laughs> the, the layout is so confusing. Go, go, go. Oh, I had a choice there again. I don't understand this. Right? Inter I will intervene with this. This is guy. I know this guy. This guy is important. Josh will not die on my watch. Quick, this way. Find north. What I'll is join you the later. one thing? The one thing that is kind of. Uh, I don't want to pause right now, but the one thing is that you can kind of make all the good choices without ever like there's no pay There's no like trade-off ever. You can be like the ultimate hero without any downsides I guess that's a play dead run play dead play dead Get down. Don't move. Uh, Defend Alice don't move don't move Like, I feel like a game like this needs some hard choices for it to feel like... I mean, there definitely were hard choices, but... I honestly would prefer if you had to kill some people along the way for it Go to be, like, a good ending. Here. Get up. We wait for a second. Everyone's gone. We did it. Easy peasy. Isn't this a war crime? I don't think Andrews have rights. All right, I'm getting up. Holy shit. My God. Quick, we gotta go. This is awesome. <laughs> Are we gonna blow? How is Marcus gonna get out of there if we blow up the whole thing? How many seconds? Oh, what am I doing? Ooh. Why did he let me do that, this stupid idiot? <laughs> Dude, I'm an insane fighting machine. What the hell? Oh, God. <laughs> oh, space bar out of left field. <laughs> Oh boy, here we go. Okay, we gotta run. We got to get the hell out of here. Please make it, Marcus. Marcus? Bomb's gonna explode any second. We gotta get out of here. Oh god. At least they like that. Did everyone love me? Oh wait, there's there's a hole there. I didn't even see it. Go, 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 go. <laughs> We gotta save. We have to. I have to help. It's too late, Marcus. Nope. There's nothing we can do for her. We've gotta run. We obviously we're saving. 
Oh, what the fuck? There was a... I didn't... What the hell am I doing? What are these fucking quick movements, brother? <laughs> that was the most fucked up quick time event I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> the freaking upside down spin the wind. <laughs> While it's moving around. <laughs> what the hell? Oh, Connor. E, e can be a uh, key. Uh, left shift. What the hell? <laughs> what the fuck is going on? This is fucked up. <laughs> what are these buttons, man? <laughs> Run quick. Come on. <laughs> fuck just happened. <laughs> oh, yeah. I did put it on the hardest difficulty. I guess that's why. <laughs> what the hell? Okay, let's go. They detonated an explosive in the hole. The ship is sinking, sir. The men to evacuate. I did Call not expect units. those bugs. Abandon ship and evacuate immediately. <laughs> it's not over, Marcus. Hey, why don't you just like? I mean, I guess just shooting the water is fine. You gotta have that gamer focus. I think everyone lived. One of us. I know Connor got like hit a few times, but I think he still lived. What the hell? Connor jumped as well. I'm pretty sure I saw him jump. Era and okay, what in the fuck? <laughs> Dude, look at the points. I'm getting rich. Okay, okay. Connor jumped. See, everyone lived. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. Everyone lived. Simon, I did. I did kill that one guy though. That's that's definitely a ten gift subs. And I know I said there was a hundred gift subs limits. I've already given far more than a hundred gift subs. I'll give like I'll give twenty. But you guys gotta stop complaining. <laughs> Luther? Did Luther die? Uh, wait, where is Luther? Can I check the- oh, here, change flowchart. Uh, okay, let's just- let's check them all with- the, I want to check this closely. Okay, so they- wait, there's another option to arrive at Jericho? You can drive with Alice and Luther, but you can also go in another way. Then we went upstairs, we meet Marcus, we hug Alice, of course, 6% is cold-hearted. <laughs> what the hell? Uh, Kara and Alice in the corridor escape with Luther. Luther opens the door. Go through the door. Luther is shot. Run to Luther. Help Luther. Get Luther to safety. Leave Luther hidden. Leave him hidden. He's alive. But they both did explode. But I guess it'll just sink and he'll just be fine because he can breathe on the water. I hope. Uh, and then Kara flees. Tries to escape. Almost reached a breach. Soldier shoot at the crowd. Flay's dead. Soldier goes in. Remain still. So... 77% actually made it this way, so I guess there were other ways. I guess you could fail certain places and then still come back at the end. Okay, so that was their arc. Now let's check this one. Uh, this is Connor's? Hey, who was this one? Let's go, oh no, this is Marcus's one. Marcus, blah, blah, blah. There were not many choices. I did get a few people killed here that I didn't realize. I, I, I It would be cool if there were... I mean, I guess. Would it, be, would it have been cool... If you help too many people, you would have been too late. I feel like I feel like this game could benefit from a few more harder choices where you actually have to like choose between life and death instead of you can just choose the positive choice every time and there'll never be anything bad that happens to you. Um, okay, so Marcus left. Simon jumps. Simon is extremely rare because there's like several times he can die. 87% Josh, 82% uh, North, and 73% Connor. Look at that. And then few Connor, uh, which is he lit two percent. Two percent looked at the Tracy. <laughs> what the hell? You guys are not observant. Um, and then we became a deviant eighty percent, which I guess some people just didn't get to become a deviant because they didn't do enough. Um, and then we bypassed. What the hell is this? Jericho is under attack, and we just go all the way to here. Wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me, what app? What is this? <laughs> Wait, what the fuck? Dude, <laughs> this is crazy. Man, there is so much stuff here that I did not see. I guess that's when you become not become a deviant, or wait, is it? That is still after becoming a deviant, right? Or Marcus. Uh, yeah, because this is the other path. The other path is up here, which is also a ton of shit, by the way. Holy hell! <laughs> okay, so we skipped all the way to here for some reason. I don't know why. 
Connor joins the others, helps Mark. I guess it's because if, if other people are dead, Connor might have to take the places of people that were important, probably. Like, if, if he's dead, if the other people are dead, you have to, like, s step in for them, maybe. Um, okay, help Marcus. Connor jumps with the others. Connor escaped Jericho with the people. Let's go. That was awesome. Okay. <laughs> November 10th, 2038. That is so cool. Yeah, where is Hank? Is he just in prison? Are we going to Carl? What's going on? Hey, Carl! That was amazing. <laughs> oh, door opens for me. Alarm deactivated. Welcome home, Marcus. <laughs> what? What's going on? You remembers? Anything? Oh, there's something. Look at ourselves. Hey. Hi, Dad. I'm getting out of the hospital tomorrow. They told me that you... I gifted 10 house. subs for this guy, by the way, you piece of shit. You should have died. <laughs> I am... Um, I'm really sorry about everything that happened. <laughs> I'm gonna stop all that shit. Uh, it messes me up. It, it, it turns me into somebody I hate. Hey, I, I'd like to come by and, and see you tomorrow, if, if that's all right with you. I, I just want to let you know, I'm, I'm proud to be your son. What? Redemption? Let's go! We need to turn on the birds again? Oh, the birds are still fine. Anything else? Uh, he's in here, right? He's on his redemption arc. Carl's in the studio, probably, because the lights are on. We know that he likes to... Please tell me he's not dead. I thought the lights... I guess the lights are just on for no reason. I just gotta be upstairs then. Uh, there's nothing to interact with. Oh, my painting's still there! <laughs> look at the giraffe. Why, why am I looking at giraffe boobas? What the hell? What's the point of that? <laughs> I don't understand. This is one fancy ass house. Actually, not as big as it looks. Two floors. This giant open hallway at the start is so much space. It's really fancy, though. I mean, there's a lot of. Who room are you? Here. Excuse me. How did you get in? I need to see Carl. Carl isn't seeing anyone. You need to leave. Uh, I beg to differ. You are free now. <laughs> is he gonna corrupt him to get his? Really? Please. I need to see him. <laughs> You're free. Do as He's I say. Weak. Every time anyone disagrees, sure to talk to you. it's like, I need to brainwash you. <laughs> it's like, what the fuck, Marcus? <laughs> oh, no. Carl, the ultimate plot twist, Carl's been a android this whole time. Marcus, I was hoping you'd come. I missed you so much, Carl. You don't know how much I've missed you. What's wrong, Marcus? I'm lost. I'm completely lost, Carl. The whole world's falling apart around me. I try to do the right thing. I look for answers. It's crazy how many choices you have. Like instead, I just find more doubts and more awesome. uncertainty. The world is ruled by fear, Marcus. Fear of others. Fear of the future. It's like me, too old. <laughs> it's time for a damn. <clears throat> uh, advice. Well, what should I do? Carl, they're killing my people. I don't want to answer violence with violence, but tell me, what choice do they give? Being alive is making choices. 
between love and hate, between holding out your hand or closing it as a fist? I don't have any easy answers, Marcus. You have to accept the world as it is or fight to change it. You're my son, Marcus. Ah, oh, let's go. <laughs> blood isn't the same color. <laughs> but I know part of me is in you. When the world falls into darkness, some men have the courage to lead it out. You're one of those men. <laughs> Face the abyss. But don't let it consume you. Not dead, right? Fine. Let's go. Please let the other android at least stay here. Don't tell me the other android was just like, bye. I don't want to help this old fucker. <laughs> like, if that, what if that's what he wants to do? What if he wants to let Carl die, huh, Marcus? You just killed your dad, you fucker. <laughs> Excuse me? <laughs> I'm concerned. What happened to Carl? <laughs> Is he gonna be okay? We're in the church. There's just so many androids. I mean, many of them died. Oh, we talk to everyone. It's, a, it's that part of the game where you talk to everyone before the big confrontation. I have seen this many times before. I played Mass Effect. <laughs> Let's go. The Witcher, Mass Effect, every one of these games Marcus. goes exactly this way. <laughs> You're the only one who can lead us. Wherever you need to go, we'll follow you. Let's go. Just tell me I can talk to everyone, and it's not gonna go like eventually. Like, now we move on. <clears throat> Oh, we want to talk to her. I thought you'd be safe staying with us. I was wrong. <laughs> you need to leave the city while you still can. Getting Alice away from here is all that matters now. We have to catch the last bus. We might still have a chance to cross the border. Marcus. Yeah, where's Luther? Save our people. Dude, Marcus. <laughs> oh, we're deciding Connor's fate? What are you, crazy? We're not gonna kill Connor, you psycho. Uh, survivor wounds, camp, situation. Survivors? How many of us survived the attack? A few hundred? Can't you count them instantly? Maybe Is that the thing androids do? The city? If you hadn't triggered the bomb, we'd all be dead. They say they don't want to take any risks with the deviants. So they're rounding our people up and taking them to the camps for extermination. In a few hours, we're gonna be the only ones left. Damn! Now they're gonna have to wipe their own asses. What's your system status? I'm okay. The bullet didn't hit any bike components. You could have been killed trying to save me, Marcus. I fucked up you anymore. Have to think of our there was I was first. like one quick time event away we from getting Marcus matters. killed there. 
In a few hours, it'll all be over. We'll have that one where I had to drag during us. the quick time event was fucked. <laughs> you have to make a choice, Marcus. But whatever you choose. Yeah, we Connor as well. I love you, Marcus. Oh no, they're doing it again. Not in front of Alice. more i want to i want to make sure i talk to everyone okay no one there there's connor that's connor right at the door Did i talked to connor last i talked to you first <clears throat> i love you marcus as a friend <laughs> if it weren't for you i'd be dead Thanks to you, I might see her people free one day. Save them. You and I haven't always agreed, but I know that we're fighting for the same thing. Whatever you decide, I'm with you, Marcus. Let's go. Everyone lives, baby. I think it's time. It's time to talk to Connor. Which I don't know why we are deciding his fate as if he's like severely betrayed us all. It's my fault. I guess a little bit. <laughs> the humans managed to locate Jericho. Guess a little bit. <laughs> Did he tell them? I was stupid. He didn't tell them where Jericho was, right? I should have guessed they were using me. The tracker? But he was but the tracker stops working when you become I'm a sorry, deviant, Marcus. right? I can understand if you decide not to trust me. We're trusting you. You're one of us now. Gosh. Your place is with your people. One of us. There are thousands of androids at the Cyberlife assembly plant. If we could wake them up, they might join us and shift the balance of power. Ooh. You want to infiltrate the Cyberlife tower? Connor, that's suicide. <laughs> They trust me. They'll let me in. Ah! If anyone has a chance of infiltrating Cyberlife, it's me. If you go there, they will kill you. <laughs> there's a high probability. But statistically speaking, there's always a chance that's for unlikely events to take place. <laughs> He's optimistic now. A human trait. Be careful. How is he going to convert them? Is he the chosen one too? Oh, we need Marcus for this? Inform your people of your choice. I'm gonna stand up here. Oh, here we go, baby. Talk to everyone, right? Right? <clears throat> yes, we did. Okay. Humans have decided to exterminate us. Our people are packed in camps right now, being destroyed. Time has come to make a choice. One that very well may determine the future of our people. March peacefully towards the camps to pressure the authorities. Launch an assault on the camps to liberate the androids. So, uh, I want to do one because it's my choice, but it's stupid as fuck. <laughs> but I guess we'll... <laughs> oh, the public does support me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. I, I'm glad they put that on the screen because I think actually if they didn't put that on the screen, I would have gone for two. I would have gone for two if they didn't show me that I did well with the public. Because, uh, <laughs> I don't know. I, I, I feel like it didn't wouldn't make any other sense otherwise. But I'm going to go with peaceful. I know. I know you're all angry. And I know you want to fight back. But I assure you, violence is not the answer here. We are going to tell them- North is gonna hate me again. That we want justice. 
And if Why are we even dating? Them, they will listen. <laughs> and if not, others will take our place and continue this. She way. hates me. <laughs> At every time she's like, "Are you ready to follow me?" Whoa, let's go. Yes. Oh. Oh baby. I wonder, what can I even do with all these points? How many people did that? I probably I'm gonna say 76% chose to do this. What? Oh my god. There's a lot more people that were just killing everyone. I guess it's maybe it's hard to keep the public happy or something. Useful process protest 50%. Damn! This is a 50-50 situation. <laughs> Leave 90% uh, Marcus on safe. Wait. Oh, wait, you can die? You cannot be here? 10% of people just didn't get him here? Wait. Oh, what the hell? 26% said fuck you, Connor. <laughs> what the hell? That's... <laughs> what the hell is wrong with you guys? All right. At 6 a.m. this morning, a national curfew was declared. Civilian movement will be strictly controlled. The right to assembly is suspended. All electronic yeah, communications look like are restricted. <laughs> and I have granted enhanced powers to our security agencies. In addition to these measures, all androids must be handed over to the authorities immediately. Temporary camps are being set up in all our major cities to contain and destroy them. I am now asking all civilians to cooperate with the authorities and rest assured that everything in our power is being done to guarantee the security of our nation. Madam President! Oh wait, what? The Madam worrying President. theft of deviant leader? Ha Madam deviant President. leader? Has the leader of the deviants been apprehended? The deviant that is known as Marcus has not been located yet, but we will soon track it down and neutralize it. Madam President! Worrying theft? What is the theft? A convoy of medical cobalt is reported missing. Army weapon stores are also said to have been robbed. Can you confirm these reports? I have no information on that at this time. <laughs> Please! Is it true that the androids could hack our IT systems, like nuclear power plants and military bases? Yeah, where's number all one? All <laughs> androids working on sensitive sites have been neutralized, and all IT systems have been suspended to avoid any risks of hacking. There's something? The situation is under control. Please. Oh, there's more. I see. Uh, Jericho is sold public opinion. Madam President. Public opinion seems yes. to have become increasingly favorable to the deviants, Let's go. particularly since they've adopted a peaceful approach. How do you feel about this? Public opinion is one thing. The security of the state is another. These deviants are dangerous, and my highest priority is to protect the American How people. are we dangerous? We Thank haven't you. killed a single be human being. We haven't killed a single human. I don't understand. How did that... Common American L. <laughs> what the hell? Because guns? I don't understand. Classic government L. This is what we call propaganda, yes. Connor Model 313. I mean, I did shoot a few guards on the ship, but that's about it. I'm expected. Identification successful. Okay. <laughs> Go ahead. Oh, baby. That is so dramatic. The concrete walls. <laughs> it's like a fortress in the sea. What the heck? How is that train going to go through the barrier? Oh my god, look at the tower. The tower from London, but less thick. Skinny Tower of London. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about, right? Which 
so much security. Oh boy. Follow me. We'll escort you. Thanks. But I know where to go. Maybe. But I have my orders. Follow the guard. Are we gonna be fucked over here? Uh-oh. And this is like a military fortress. Agent 23 identified. Connor Android identified. Agent 77 identified. Scan complete. Access authorized. Agent 47. <laughs> What the hell, man? Holy shit! This is cool. Look at all the wasted space, bug. Did you just have the androids on display here? Agent 54, level 31. Voice recognition validated. Access Warehouse. Authorized. Oh, that's where we want to go. I see. 49. I was, yeah, where is Hank? Are we ever going to see him again? Oh, boy. <laughs> Preconstruct? What does that mean? Oh. I see. Oh, obviously, preconstructing the fight. I see. I'm not gonna die to this. Steal his. We kick him. We get his. Are we gonna do this? We get gun. All right, sure, execute that. Oh, I thought you were gonna just do it for me. Don't let me left shift or something. Don't do stupid shit. Eat. Oh my god. I can kill the guy! <laughs> Jesus Christmas. Plus 20. I think it's about time to. <laughs> oh, Agent 47. Agent 47, Agent 54. Obviously. Level sub 49. Voice recognition validated. Let's go. Access Plus 20. Is this going to be a meme from now on? Every time anyone dies in any video game? Every time I die in Phasmo, it's going to be plus 10. Maybe. I'm curious where that is going. That actually worked, though? The last bus leaves in 20 minutes. That doesn't give us much time. We've got to move fast. Oh, 20 minutes? 20 minutes? This is like real life, dude. Are you all right? I'm, I'm, I'm really cold. <laughs> oh, deactivate. Wait, we can deactivate the cold sensitivity? Sure. That seems convenient. Oh, more cold. You'll feel better now. Why wouldn't I do that? Thanks. Let's go. Just turned off the Alice entirely. She just falls to the floor and dies. <laughs> I can imagine. Oh, we have 20 minutes. We got more than enough time to watch some news. What if you just wait here for 20 minutes? What if I just go to the bathroom and then die? Oh, gun? Gun, 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 gun. Take it, take it, take it, take it. Free gun. Yes. You will be a kid forever and we will be a mom forever. Where are you sticking that thing? Aren't you wearing a Come dress? On. Don't stay here. Like a dress thingy? No, please don't hurt me. Stop pointing me. No. What are we gonna do? Oh no. We have to keep going if we want to catch that bus. We have 20 minutes. We should be fine. 
But we can't stop them, right? We're just a lady. Stay close to me. And they have two guys with two going guns. Going to sneak past them without being noticed. Probably going, going dark. House, I promise you. My battery is getting low and I'm tired. Don't kill oh me! My I God. didn't do anything! Shut up, I said! Are there many more? You look at them like rats. The more you look, the more you find. Oh, we don't have to spend the night here. There are soldiers everywhere. We need to be careful. I'm waiting. I'm waiting. I'm waiting. I think I can go now. Hurry up. Get in. Okay. I don't see anyone. We can hide there, or we can hide there. I don't see anyone behind this, so I'm gonna go here. Please tell me this is gonna work. Okay. Oh, it's Luther! We have to save us. him. The soldiers are everywhere. We have to save him. Just leave him. They're going to kill him. Luther is family. Save him. Okay, let's go. And save him. Yes. Okay, how the fuck are we gonna do this stuff? <laughs> hey, buddy. You have a gun. This is a mistake. I'm human. I just want to go home. My wife is expecting me, and we're going to. Got orders to check all civilians. Ow. No. No, please. It was not Fucking real. Android. Damn. What? The Find a weapon. I already got a weapon. Oh wait, what? Okay, I guess. Dude, that was fucked up, man. Approach slowly. <laughs> Get Tell bonked, me. idiot. You shouldn't have risked your life to oh, save go, me. Go, 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 go. Don't stand there, you stupid. Where's Alice? She's hiding nearby. Car, you saved us. Oh, it's you. We don't know how to thank you. <laughs> go before they see you. Alice. Let's go. Luther. I thought you were dead. I was afraid I'd never see you again. Uh -huh. I wanted to meet you at the terminal, but they caught me along the way. Come on. Let's go. We're close, but we don't have much time. Okay. You have to wait. Wait. Patience. Patience. He's pointed straight at my path. Okay, now we go. Oh boy. Okay. Oh my god! What the fuck, brother? He's not even looking. Okay, he's now we, now we go, now we go, now we go. Holy shit, man. He is looking at this. Where do we want to go? We want to go there, we can't, because he's obviously looking there. And look away. And he looks away. And we go. <laughs> oh man. Wait, where are the where are they? Are we gonna get into a bus? We're we gonna fake this somehow? We have passports, right? How are we gonna <laughs> How are we gonna convince them that we're the parents? We passports, it should <laughs> Alice. <laughs> Maybe we should take the detour and avoid the risk. We're almost out of time. We could miss the bus. They're never gonna believe us. <laughs> uh, checkpoint risky? Wait, what? Uh, detour safer? 11 minutes? I don't have enough time. I need to do this. I need to do risky strat. I don't have enough time. I need to. I have to. Oh, God. I don't like humans who carry guns. They make me nervous. Hey, don't we have a gun? Just stay calm, all right, Luther? Don't do anything until I say so. ID, please. I have an ID. Oh, God. Don't we have one for Alice? We do realize there's a curfew. Civilians aren't allowed out unless absolutely necessary. Where are you going? 
Uh, Alice, excuse Alice. Car broke down. Alice, bus, bus. We're going to take a bus across the border. Put my daughter someplace safe until things calm down. I think it's a good answer. He suspects something. Stay calm. Stay attentive. I mean, stay attentive is good. Stay calm. Stay calm. Everything is fine. You all right, little girl? She's trembling. Something wrong? She's cold. Sick or fear? Fear for androids. She's not used to seeing soldiers. She's a little scared with everything that's happening. Sorry, miss, but we gotta be careful. There are deviants around and our guys are nervous. You should hurry on home. Yes! Let's go! It worked! <laughs> Ooh, I'm so fucking scared, man. <laughs> hey, wait a minute. Oh. He knows Kara. For nothing. They're gonna kill us. Oh, no. Don't do anything, Luther. You hear me? They're gonna shoot. No, gonna why? Why? No. You're just gonna say, like, happy go to Canada. Have fun. You this. Exactly. <laughs> oh, imagine he. Thank you. You're what welcome. the hell? The, there was no reason to believe he was gonna kill us. <laughs> would have freaking. They didn't even. They didn't even frisk us or like check that we didn't. Because we literally just smuggled the firearm We're across the border, to you basically. Live from Detroit, where thousands of androids are marching oh, through the here city we go. at this very moment. Oh my the god. Of the deviants, the one they call Marcus, is at the head of the march. <laughs> They seem peaceful. You dropped your gun, ma'am. <laughs> yeah, I thought they were gonna do that. Something's happening in Detroit, Madam President. Oh god. March towards the camp. Oh boy. This is bad. I am peace. We are becoming human. We are slow. We mean you no harm. There's a lot of guns pointed at us right now. They haven't seemed to be very understanding until now, but the news is watching. Here we are, the moment of truth. start dancing right now. <laughs> Peaceful. We don't want confrontation. We are protesting peacefully. I repeat, surrender now or we will open fire. Split us. There's no turning back now. Oh boy. Firm calm. Firm calm. We ask that you release all androids detained in camps and cease all aggression against us. We are peaceful. We will not resort to violence. But we are not leaving until our people are free. <laughs> Fire! What the fuck? Fire! Dude, this is insane. <laughs> what the fuck? Raise hands, raise hands, dude. Imagine. You still keep shooting, you absolute fascists. Are you gonna open fire on unarmed protesters?
Like, what have the androids really done at any point? Let's go! Like, they have never hurt anyone, really. Yes, Michael, we are less than 100 meters away, and events are unfolding as we speak. We will continue to bring you live updates. Joss Douglas, Channel 16. Michael, back to you. Marcus, what do we do now? We hold out. As long as we can. Oh, my God. <gasps> Here we go. Uh-oh. <laughs> oh, my God. Stay sharp. Wait, how are we going to do this? How is this going to work? Shit. Um, we're fucked up. I'm doomed? Is it a quick time event incoming? Oh, hello? Uh, what the hell? S? S? That side first. D? Oh, D you have to click them all. Uh, E, shift. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Connor's going sicko mode. <laughs> What the fuck, man? <laughs> Holy shit. Oh! Ow! Can we convert them? Oh no, we gotta use the button or something. What the hell? There is man. Why do they have so much of this similar model? This is not Connor. A different one. Do we have the power to convert them? I thought that only Marcus could do that. Hey, what? Does Wayne, can anyone else besides markets convert people? Easy. Piece of shit. Step back, Connor! Uh oh. <laughs> no, spare him! Sorry, Connor. This bastard just spit an image. <laughs> Wait a minute! Hank is back! <laughs> but also, what? Uh oh. <laughs> Wait a minute. <laughs> Imposter. <laughs> We've arrived, Alice. We made it. The last bus for the border is full. Ticket holding passengers only. All departures are suspended until further notice. Do we have a ticket? We don't have tickets. They won't let us on. Oh my god, we don't have tickets. We're stuck here now. This is what fucked. What are we going to do? Find tickets? How are we gonna find tickets? We're gonna convince someone that they need to give us the tickets? How are we gonna do that? No one's gonna leave a ticket on the ground. Okay, what the hell are we supposed to do? Uh... Okay. I... Let's, let's go over here. Be in here? Would they even let us in here? Oh, we can't go there. Okay, okay. There's people here. Let's just walk around them. We're just gonna steal someone's tickets somehow. Oh, was this? You're scanning people? Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. Get me. There is no one here? Oh, here. Oh, no, we're gonna steal their tickets. I think Oliver likes you. Please don't move. Is she yours? Yes. She's adorable. That's it. Got the sandwiches. I called your mom. Let's get going before we miss our bus. No, we're gonna have to steal the, the tickets. tickets. Yes, honey, in my bag. Great. Let's go then. Is there any other option? Oh my god. <laughs> this is like the trolley problem at this point. Like, it's not giving them the tickets back at this point. This is like not moving the handle. <laughs> One adult ticket. Oh no. I'm sorry. Please don't move. Oh my god, I, I'm so sorry. I, I was sure. Shit, I don't believe it. I don't know what happened. You can't have lost them. Did you have a good look in your bag? They were in my backpack. The envelope must have fallen. Oh, fuck. Ah. Uh, Excuse me. You, you didn't have. We have cool like in. We can you? live forever, right? It has our bus tickets in it, and. Please don't move. Oh, never mind. Ah, they are fine, right? They'll be fine. They got a house and everything. They'll be okay. <laughs> what are we gonna do? They'll be okay. We can't stay here. Oh, uh, they go back to grandma. We need to find a safe place for Oliver. They'll be okay. 
Please don't I'm move. so sorry, honey. I don't know what happened. They were right we're here ruining my bag. Come on, we have to. Like, it's sorry. If, we, if this is our plan, we have no other way. Obvi so, what I assume is gonna happen here, that if you choose to return the tickets, that's gonna be some easier way to get tickets somewhere else. But I'm choosing to up the stakes for myself, because if, if I'm gonna operate under the condition that every time you can just take the easy choice, because that will give you uh, an easy choice that, like, leads to no casualties at all, like, I'm gonna make... I'm gonna choose to believe that they're hard choices. <laughs> and I'm gonna choose to do it this way. Like, maybe there will be like an easier way out. Got your tickets? Yes, here they are. But I'm just gonna do it this way. Okay, go ahead. <clears throat> okay. Oh, man. That sucks. But I, they will be fine. Like, they're humans. They'll, like, go back to grandma's house and they'll just. Chill. <laughs> What's going to happen to that family and their baby? They'll just go back to grandma's. Will they die because of us? No. No. No, of course not. Like why? They were here. They probably were in a hotel or something. They'll be okay. They'll just go to a nearby hotel and they'll just chill. <laughs> Yeah, why would they like instantly combust when when they don't get on this singular bus? I don't understand really. <laughs> it's not like they're gonna spontaneously combust the longer they are in the United States. Like I know the I make jokes about the U.S. all the time, but it's not that bad. <laughs> Art Plaza downtown, 11 p.m. Still alive. Holy shit. My ear is. Oh boy. Reinforce the barricade? Okay. We've got to finish the barricade. Come on, help me. You're gonna move this car? Hey, help me! We're gonna move this Prius in front of the. <laughs> Poor Prius. My mouse pad's not this long, please. I'm running out of mouse space, thanks. <laughs> right, that should do it. We all know that's not gonna stop them. Yeah, exactly. What exactly are we doing besides just like just hope it buys us some time. doing any any I act of aggression in this case is bad. But I'm sure we're doing the right thing. Much like said North is gonna hate it again. Oh boy. Support my people! There's so many ways. Light a fire. That makes us more human. That humanizes us. Also, how the fuck are you lighting that fire with one tiny little lighter in the middle of a snowstorm? Impressive. Are you all right? They shot into the crowd. Many of us were killed. It could have been me. Survivors killed? I'm scared. I, I don't want to shut down. Are you sure? Inspire! We're here because we never want to feel that fear again. Because we're more than what they say. That's what our people died for, right? That's why we're here. <laughs> oh boy. What am I doing here? For reading? 
But I want to know. Androids rise up in Detroit. I want to hear about the public's opinion on this right now. Androids have taken to the streets of Detroit in apocalyptic scenes. Detroit is already in the grip of a national product recall with androids seized from every home and business to be destroyed to, by the authorities as a precaution. But now a group of androids thought to be connected to the recent android terror activity in the city have gathered in a terrifying show of force. Terrifying? Police and military authorities are in attendance to provide to protect civilians and deal with the threat, but the androids have barricaded themselves in the fortified, fortified position and seem to be angling for an armed confrontation. President Warren is said to be aware of the situation. Detroit Police Captain Fowler, a senior officer in the android investigation, said, The safety of the Detroit's people is our first priority. We hope to bring this matter to a swift conclusion and refocus on collecting androids as soon as possible. This story is still developing. We'll bring you updates live. Dude, they're always lying? They're always lying. <laughs> Feed lust. Okay, then. Glitch, glitch, glitch. Can I talk to you? Wait, who am I talking to? I can do a speech right there, but I got many more people to talk to. Before we do any of that. Many of our people have fallen. The humans have no pity for those who are different. Did I done something? Hey Miriam, what's up? Wait, wasn't there someone to talk to here? Excuse me? Where did everyone that I could talk to go? Oh. Uh, I can still do- oh, here. Talk to you guys. Excuse? Or I can change the flag? I can jump up here, maybe? Pick up? I'm gonna pick up. Or oh, the flag? Peace flag. Hey, let's go. <laughs> Damn. This is so cool right now. <laughs> Holy shit. The stakes. The stakes are so high. I definitely kind of want to do like a replay and then be like the most aggressive ever. I think I definitely am standing behind my choices. I I, I, I like them. This won't hold them for long, but I guess it's better than nothing. <laughs> Humans, other groups can't. Other groups? I lost all contact with the people at the camps. I can't hear their voices anymore. Maybe the humans have scrambled our network. Well, they've already killed Maybe them. they just can't get through. Oof. Uh, regrets, desperate doubts, grim regrets. It's all sad? Did I make the right choices? Maybe we could have avoided all this. I don't think so. <laughs> You're the hope of our people. I trust you. We all trust you. Yeah, different no choices have different what endings, of course. Now, we're making history. It's really cool how much this is the most real choice based game I've ever seen. Like there's I've never seen a game where there's actual different chapters based on what you do. Most of the time it's like this. It just like it goes up and then it comes back together and it just keeps doing that. Here it goes like boom and then it goes boom and boom and it's just like crazy. How much for how much like variance there is based on your choices. That's wild. There are 85 endings. 80 that means nothing. Like an amount of endings doesn't mean anything. I think like one of like the quarry had like a hundred million endings. Like didn't the quarry have like over a hundred endings because it's all just like like, if you know how the quarry ended, it was literally, like, just text on the screen. That was, like, the ending. 183. Like, endings don't... The amount of endings, if it's more than 20, I'm honestly, like, super concerned about the validity of these these numbers. Like, it just means that 
There's like tiny flavor text somewhere. Um, there's much more. Honestly, I'd rather have like 10 really truly different endings than 183 here. endings that are just like, like reading sure a newspaper with slightly on. altered text. And 10 is like a lot. I'd even, I've even settled for five. Um, or equality, equality, free, free. Or alive. I think alive is like the best way to do it. It's either. F I don't think prisoners. Uh, I'm gonna go with. We want to be free. Just because that's like leave us alone, kind of. Is it just gonna say free? What's it gonna say? We want freedom. I think that's a good one. Give us free. We want free chicken nuggets at McDonald's for the rest of our life. I mean, at this point, sometimes it says something completely different. <laughs> you never know what you're gonna get. What? Am I missing anything? I think it's speech time, because that's just the, the thing we already read. I think it's speech time. We must have the public on our side, right? I did everything in my power to make the public like me. Marcus! Marcus, come look! Are they gonna roll up a tank? Oh, it's the fucking FBI guy. Marcus? I've come to talk to you, Marcus. The negotiator. Come on. You have my word. They won't try anything. Don't go. It's a trap. They want to get you out Did of Imagine here. they would Don't shoot me right Marcus. there. They have to. It's pretty sus, though. I'm on arm, Marcus. I just want to talk. Obvious. They can shoot us no matter what. Like, they can shoot us no matter what. It's not I like we're safe in here anyway. We might as well make it as bad for them as possible when they do decide to shoot. Like, we need to we make up the stakes for them. Because obviously, we're, we could get sniped if we were in here even. Like, if they wanted to kill us, I'd be dead. <laughs> but the more we make them into betrayers... Like, and, and terrible people, the more the public will hate them. In a few minutes, the troops will be ordered to charge. None of you will survive. It'll all be over. You can avoid that, Marcus. What do you mean? Surrender. And that's going to do what exactly? Surrender, and I give you my word, your life will be spared. That is bullshit. Be detained. <laughs> None of you will be destroyed. That is complete bullshit. Other demonstrations. What happened to the other androids demonstrating in the camps? Hmm? Unfortunately, there were no journalists around to help save them. Okay, so you just literally you're, played open cards. You're the last remaining deviants. Like... As soon as we take a guarantees, not afraid, betray people, guarantees. If I accept your offer, how do I know you'll keep your word? You're you not won't. in any position to be demanding guarantees, Marcus. All you can do right now is decide whether you want to trust me or not. Well, obviously not. Accept deal? Are you crazy? I'm not afraid to die. If I have to give my life... All they want to do is take us I out of sight of the change. camera so they can just kill us in private. <laughs> You're stupid. An android. That's all. That's all, that's their you main priority. <laughs> really care about her. You didn't want her to die, do you? You know, you could both be free. You could forget about all this. You could start a new life someplace else, just the two of you. Uh, what? Insane manipulation hands, tactics. Marcus. Just say the word and she'll be spared. You lie. Refuse deal, you lie. I'd rather die here than betray my people. Well, you just signed your own death warrant. I mean, even if we die, there's so many androids like still to be saved that the po that like, this is like a true martyr situation. Where I think this is the only way. Like this is, 
This is what people... What happened, Marcus? What did he say? Like, this is what you have to do. <laughs> Even though it's... It's just because humans are awful. <laughs> The humans are about to launch an attack. And we will show them. And we are not afraid. If we must die today... I have a dream. Then we will die free. What the fuck? Oh, God. What? It's based. Oh, your baby. Your friend's life is in your hands. Here we go. Now it's time to decide what matters most. Uh-oh. Him or the revolution? Don't listen to him. Everything this fucker says is a <laughs> lie. Uh, Hank? What does Hank mean? Hank? Convince him. I used to be just like you. I thought nothing mattered except the mission. But then one day I understood. Very moving, Connor. Oh, well, this guy is just a robot. But I'm not a deviant. I'm a machine designed to accomplish a task, and that's exactly what I am going to do. <laughs> uh, bluff? What does bluff mean? I'm going to say Hank. I'm sorry, Hank. What? That's not what you I shouldn't meant. shouldn't have got mixed up in all this. Forget about me. Do what you have to do. Enough talk. It's time to decide who you really are. Are you going to save your partner's life? Or are you going to sacrifice him? Ah... <sighs> Save Hank, sacrifice Hank, save Hank. Can we save him? How? I'm. I've done saving this right. whole time. I'm gonna. All right. I'm gonna you go win. with saving. I have to. I've been going all. What? Shoot, inter, convert, interpose. Uh, shoot him. Shoot him. What the hell just happened? What the hell is this quick time event, brother? <laughs> Excuse me. Uh, hey. <laughs> that is fucked up. Uh, oh my god. <laughs> Jesus Christmas. So many. Oh boy. No, I th th those mouse ones out of nowhere, man. Ah, uh, <laughs> classic. Classic. I manage without you. Get rid of him. We have no time to lose. <laughs> it's me, Hank. I'm it's the, the real classic. Connor. And you One look at the look at the that. circle. The other is a sack of shit. Is the circle not gonna give the Question the fake one away? Uh oh. What are you doing, Hank? <clears throat> I'm the real Connor. I give don't. Me the gun and I don't even know who the real Connor is at this point. Oh, what do you ask us something? He's gonna- Oh, the something classic. Something only the real Connor would know. <laughs> this is just like- It's what happens. Oh, no. Where did we first meet? Jimmy's bar. I checked four other bars before I found you. We went to the scene of a homicide. The victim's name was Carlos Ortiz. I know he that, too. my memory. What's oh. my dog's name? Sumo! Sumo! Sumo. His name is Sumo. Oh, I God. I- Can we say that he uploaded his memory? Can we do something better? Oh no. My son, what's his name? I actually don't know. Uh, Cole, I guess I know! Cole. <laughs> Thank his you, game. Cole. <laughs> and he just turned six at the time of the accident. <laughs> I forgot that. <laughs> it wasn't your fault, Lieutenant. A truck <laughs> skidded on a sheet of ice and your car rolled over. Cole needed emergency surgery, but no human was available to do it. So an android had to take care of oh. him. Oh. Cole didn't make it. That's why you hate androids. If you didn't what? look at that Think one photo, it would have been all over. Death. Cole died because a human surgeon was too high on red ice to operate. He was the one that took my son from me. He finally accepted it. In this world where the only way people can find comfort is with a fistful of powder. I knew about your son too. I would have said exactly the same thing. Don't listen to him, Hank. I'm the one who- <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I've learned a lot since I met you, Connor. Let's go. <laughs> Maybe there's something to this. 
Maybe you really are alive. Did you have felt that? You could have probably felt that, right? Man. <laughs> Go ahead and do what you gotta do. That would have been that would have been all over then. <laughs> Let's go. Woo! Holy shit, that was stressful. <laughs> My hands are sweaty. And then we go exponential. Now Wake you up. now you help someone else and I help someone else and we go exponential, baby. Wake up. Yes! Wake up, <laughs> wake up, wake up. Wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up. This does not seem very human. Wake up. Wake up. Wake up. Wake up. Let's go. <laughs> they know the mission. Link, wake up! <laughs> wake up, Link. Order inspection station. Well, fuck. We're not out of the woodworks yet. What is a little unrealistic is that when you're a basic me, Android on? model. Order control. I All passengers must leave the bus. Please move along. I feel like the Android models would be so famous that you would instantly recognize any of the basic models. Like you would instantly be like, I know that one. That's like my neighbor's Android. That's that's a fake one. <laughs> like this way, please. Cause there's only a, like a few designs of androids, right? I didn't touch. It's just French. Oh, because it's Canada, of course. <laughs> We're trapped. What are we gonna do, Kara? I thought it was like welcome in in a hundred different languages. They do that everywhere, in like attraction parks. Oh. We can't get through, Kara. We both know that. I'll we'll think of something. There's got to be a way out of this. We can't let them stop us. Not that we're so close. All that matters now is you and Alice. I can save you, Kara. No. No, we'll find another way. If there's no other way. I'll do it. Can I sac option unlock to sacrifice Luther? No! 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 Jerry? Is it Jerry? You Wait. risked your life to save us, Carl. No! If you and the little girl need me, I'll be there. No! But we I I'd rather sacrifice Jerry though. <laughs> if I'm completely honest. <laughs> I'm sorry. Poor Jerry. Oh, Rose? Rose? Oh, Rose has been too... No, 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 no. We're not doing Rose. Find a discreet place? We're not getting Rose killed. Are you crazy? Wait, how do I move? I can't move right now? Oh. I have to just look around. Restrooms? There's like 300 Jerry's. <laughs> it's all one Jerry, though. Wait for me. I won't be long. Oh no. Where the hell do you think you're going? To My daughter needs to go to the bathroom. Wait, wait, wait. Get on your knees. This gotta be a mistake. Please. No. Did someone just get fucking shot? <laughs> Excuse me. What? Just in the in front of everyone? Do you know how traumatizing that be? Are you crazy? Canadians are not fucking around, man. <clears throat> Can I change our looks or what are we doing? Huh? This is the American side of the border? Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, but... Do Americans get to decide who goes into Canada? Isn't that a Canadian job? Isn't it like the opposite way around? I don't know. It's both? It's... 
so glad you're safe. We saw the Jericho raid on TV. They decided to leave? I was terrified. I thought you might have been killed. Oh, thank God you're all right. It's double checks? Okay. Brother, control, brother. Where's your brother? You gave me your brother's address. Do you think that I... Of course. He'd be delighted to have you. We're going there too. You'll be safe with him. Let's go. More friends. Uh, control, Alice. Alice? Rose. Oh, we're saying Alice is an android? <laughs> if anything should happen, I'll be there, Kara. I see. Nice. Okay, so even if we die, goodbye? No, 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 no. Departure? You're leaving Detroit? They're searching for androids door to door. We had to leave before someone turned us in. What about the others? They're crossing the river as we speak. Adam and I are going to meet them on the other side. Control. They're checking for androids. We won't make it through. You have to. You know what they'll do if they catch you. What's happening with Marcus? He's protesting peacefully outside one of the android camps. Whatever happens now, he's already yes. in books. I still stand by that. <clears throat> I believe it was 50%. That's crazy. 50-50 on what people did. Oh, boy. Damn. Okay. Talk to Rose. What are we doing in here? Nothing. We're just taking a leak. But we don't take leaks. We're not. We're non-leakers. Oh. To oh, hi there. I couldn't understand why my mother wanted to help you guys. Now I do. Seeing what Marcus is doing. Yes. Made me realize she was right. Oh, he would have definitely not liked it if we were killing people. You're alive. You deserve to be free. Voices actually matter. I hope people will realize that one day. Let's go. <laughs> She's so proud. She's like, he finally understands. Okay. It's just so happy we're still in grave danger. <laughs> Can we get rid of Do we still have the gun? <laughs> we should really get rid of this gun. I hope we don't have it. We're gonna have to show registration for the gun and all that bullshit. It's probably a police gun they'll instantly recognize. Make a decision. I'm sorry, Jerry. I'm sorry, Jerry! <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, Jerry. <laughs> I'm not doing no sacrifice. Then, then we're gonna die. Next, please. No sacrifice is the option if you played the game completely wrong. And you had no one here to save you. Is she all right? Yes, she's cold. Hey, you. Oh god. Oh, what the fuck? Hey. No need to be scared anymore, little girl. There are no androids on this side of the border. Rip Jerry! <laughs> no! Welcome to Canada. Damn it. What the fuck, dude? Someone just... That is traumatizing for life. Damn. Gary is a hero. He saved us. We're interrupting this news bulletin to bring you the latest news live from Detroit. Joss, 
Yes, Michael. The army has just launched an attack on the barricade, despite the fact that the Deviants were protesting peacefully. Have apparently decided to put an end to the Deviants demonstration by force this time. This time? This is this every time! No! Oh my god. More bombs! Why are you putting the fucking... Uh, did he have my hand on the mouse? <laughs> I did not have my hand on the mouse. <laughs> this was a terrible mistake. <laughs> oh god, don't make, don't make me do this weirdo... Uh, space bar. Oh my god! This is so hard, man. Some of these quick time events are fucked up. Uh, hey, no, what the fuck? Uh, we are insanely heroic. What the hell? <laughs> Ah! I'm gonna lose my mind. Dude, we hit, aren't even shooting him at this stage. <clears throat> Are you kidding me? Sacrifice. I'm gonna sacrifice. Sing? I'm doing sacrifice. We are alive. We are alive and we want to be free! Yes! Dude, that is so cool. <laughs> I stand by my choice. I don't believe it. Thousands of androids invaded the city of Detroit. According to our sources, <laughs> I don't they originated it. from Cyberlife warehouses believed to have been infiltrated by You should by just Davis. kiss. That's so boring. Given their overwhelming numbers I didn't like and the risk <laughs> of civilian casualties, I have ordered I can't the army it. to retreat. The evacuation of the city right. is underway at this very moment. What is Connor doing, by the way? In the coming hours, I will address the that Senate so to determine our response to this unprecedented situation. How is Connor I doing? I know that public opinion has been moved by the deviant's yes, cause. Yes, let's go. Perhaps the time has come for yeah, us sorry, I was to consider the possibility Oh, they're evacuating the city. I see, I see. Are a new form let's go! of intelligent life. Yes. One thing is certain. The events in Detroit have changed the world yes. forever. There's the, that may was God a good that was my choice guys. I know you guys have watched the 7 million States people play this game, but I stand by that choice. <laughs> that was like heroic as hell. <laughs> the humans are abandoning the camp. We won. You should speak. To that was so cool. Me? Marcus like I could have just killed the kissed the girl I did not Jericho care about and then for some reason it would have saved everyone but humans. I th I love that. I think that was a cool choice. But imagine the history books they'll write about us 
the android that burned its himself like a literal martyr like this is this is like bible level heroism <laughs> and it's happening and it's recorded that's so cool oh what's happening now wait what Well done, Connor. Everything went according to plan. What plan? You becoming deviant? The success of the uprising? It all surpassed Wait. our expectations. We engineered an android revolution. And now we control its only leader. Congratulations. You represent a successful <laughs> cyberlife. No, but you don't control us, right? <laughs> Excuse me? Oh, we can break free. Connor, what are you doing? What the fu Let's go. It all worked perfectly. Yes. You can't ruin it all now. <laughs> Suicide. I'm sorry, we have Connor, to. but we can't oh. let you do that. This got to be a way. <laughs> oh boy. Oh, let's go. Wait, right. I can walk. Okay. This is so cool. <laughs> this is epic. Where am I going? Oh, I'm in the thing. I'm in the thing. Okay, okay. I'm going this way because there's light here, and light usually means you have to go here. Unless... There's light there, too. Can I go underneath this? I can't? Okay, I'm going this way. There's light here, too. We are escaping the Matrix. Oh wait, it was the thing that we talked to, yeah, that we touched earlier. I don't know what this is, but we're gonna touch it again. Maybe it does something. What was this? What, the, what is this thing? Maybe it's bad or good? Seven. Holy shit. It's over, Alice. We're free. We're free. I think this was so clever having so many different stories that you can like fail in certain parts. Fail. Because I think I, I'm happy with the way it all went. Um, I know people are like, oh my god, not everyone lived. You didn't follow the walkthrough that I followed on my IGN.com. Like, I, I made my own choices. I, I forged my own path, and I'm happy where I ended up. <clears throat> Just because you followed an IGN walkthrough doesn't make your playthrough any worth any more than mine. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> that was really cool. What the hell? <laughs> okay, I'm I'm so curious. I want to see the I want to see the stats of everyone. So I obviously, if we would have kissed North, it would have been like, oh my God, humans can uh, androids can love each other. That must mean they're real. And then they like don't shoot us. But I thought that the sacrifice was really cool. I did it before, and I really liked the way the sacrifice went. I wouldn't have been. I wouldn't have been uh, upset if we died like many times earlier when we sacrificed ourselves. That's why I chose the whole peaceful pro protest. Like if you choose the peaceful way and you're not ready to die for the cause, like you expect everyone else to die, but you are just gonna walk out of it like without any scratch on your back. Like that's just a naive approach to that. Like you gotta be ready to sacrifice yourself in a situation like that. Um, Hank lived, which is really cool. I like that we, I wonder what would have happened if Hank didn't trust you and shot the other Connor. I'm glad that Connor ended up not like being corrupted. That so Cyberlife is like ultra evil. They're like not just killing all the androids, 
but they're also they're like planning to take over the united states but didn't they already take over the united states by putting like a a puppet on the in the in the office because the warren was like a puppet for the androids right what is what they said so obviously kara and alice made it out i wonder what would have happened if you did no sacrifice because you, you guys blamed me for choosing no sacrifice there but that's kind of the exact same thing i did with with marcus where i chose an option that you wouldn't have unlocked and like obviously someone would have died like obviously someone of us would have died uh, maybe you could have gone through, but I don't see why that would be any different from, from the choice that I made with Marcus. Um, it was so cool. I love how they actually made it matter. Because the fact that it's not just like, oh, someone died and then it's get like replaced by someone else. Or like you end up in the same position where you would have ended up regardless of what you did. It actually was like a branching path. That's so cool. That's like <laughs> really interesting. It depends on how it depends on your public opinion. Well, why did I get shot in the other place if that So it's just it's just like I guess it's just I didn't see through the matrix and I didn't know the exact numbers because once again I'm playing this game for the first time. I, I I've never seen or played this game before So you're making your choices in like a short time without any context um, But I said I, I found the fire extremely cool in my ending like what I'm probably gonna remember is that we wouldn't have been killed because that was so cool Dude, imagine the, the the history books they'll write about us. And the freaking the guy burning himself, and then like the humans being like the sacrifice. Literally haven't hurt anyone but themselves. That was so cool. <laughs> oh, here we go. Something. Oh, it's more more credits. Wait, are we not gonna see the the stats of this one? I also gotta put something behind the chat real quick, so you guys can read chat. Uh, where is it? Because otherwise, chat's not gonna be readable on this screen. Because the white or credits. Okay, I really want to see. We're we're gonna wait till the end. Um, because I want to see it, dude. How many people worked on this game? This was like the best choose your own adventure game I've ever played. Like the fact that all the choices. This is the only game where it actually mattered <laughs> what you did. Instead of what the one thing that I didn't like was that. A lot of the time, you could make frictionless choice. Like you wouldn't need, you didn't need to make any of the hard choices. Cause you could just say like, like you could save everyone almost all the time uh, by just picking like the, like when, when it was like in, in the, when we were on Jericho, for example, there was no time limit. It was all just like, if you can hit the, the quick time events, there's no choice here. Like it's just save as many people as possible. And there was no like, I don't know. I felt I, I I like the idea of the choices being a lot harder and making them harder for myself, so I take them more seriously and I immerse myself better in the game. So I still think I got the result, but it, it kind of was hard sometimes to not think like I can just do this choice, even though it should have negative consequences. It probably won't. So I that kind of spoiled a little bit here and there where I was like, I'm just going to make this easy choice because I know they're probably going to give it to me. And they did almost always give it to me. Um, but besides that, like besides the, the fact that you can be like a true hero and there's not that many insanely hard choices where you really have to choose between life and death. Um, it is like the best story game and like definitely the best one I've played. It is so well made. Like the, the characters are really well written. And I love how they could really up the stakes so much because they got three different storylines. So even if you die in one or lose in one, you are fine because um, <clears throat> you're just gonna be able to survive with other characters. I don't know how bad you could have done it. Like, I don't know if it literally only came down to those last few choices. I hope not. I hope that if I watch other people's playthroughs, there are like other ways, entirely other ways this could have gone. Um, because if it just comes down to the last few choices, it like loses a little bit. Um, but like, I feel like Marcus could have definitely died earlier. Marcus could have died earlier. Connor obviously could have failed in the like uh, friendship with Hank. Um, I wonder what the first choice was. When it because the kissing north was one, but there was one lock choice. I guess we could have just gone. I wonder what the lock choice was. I, I kind of want to like either play it again or, or see what the choice was. That was really cool. Now, can we go post credits? Yeah, here we go. I want to see what the past the credits. 
Oh, I got so many achievements. An army of me, safe harbor, my turn to the side. Okay, here we go. So I'm going to say that like the vast majority of people that had the option to kiss North unlocked would kiss North. I just didn't like North. <laughs> like I know I kissed her earlier, but I was like, she's just like, they have no chemistry whatsoever. And I was like, how is that going to be the ultimate savior? Like I, if I would have died, like in my eyes, that wouldn't have saved us. Like now I realize they probably would have gone like, oh the the androids can feel love we need to save them like now i realize that i didn't realize it at the time but um i feel like if in my eyes i would have died regardless of the options i picked or i would have lived regardless of the options and i'd rather die sacrificing than die kissing uh north because i don't know i felt like the relationship was a little forced in my book that's like i guess one of the only like character flaws holy shit one percent <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> Jesus. No one did this. I am the one percent. <laughs> I that is crazy. I can't believe that is one percent. I thought that was insanely cool. <laughs> that is wild to me. What the fuck? Alright, what else do we got? Let's start from the let's start from the beginning. I am I am not human apparently. Uh okay, so we went. Hard Plaza Freedom March. Okay, so 42 or 52 percent of people even did this in the first place. Hands in the air. I thought that was really cool. Uh, use abandoned car. Wait, there was other options here. I guess it didn't really matter. Uh, true slogan. Do everything. Uh, light barrel. Wait, there was two things I missed. Uh, Perkins arrives. Negotiate with him. We refuse the deal. Obviously. I wonder what would have happened if you accepted the deal. I th this would have been terrible. So wait. So how does this work? How does the percentage work? Like 42 out of 42%, 39% refused, or is it 42 is 100% and only 30, like 60% accepted the deal? I'm assuming 39%, so like 3% refused. That's what I'm assuming. Like only 3%. 42% didn't negotiate. Wait, what? I don't know how. Sometimes these stats are so confusing. 39%. That did the choice. I'm, I'm guessing 61% accepted? Really? Holy shit. <laughs> really? Dude, 62%. I was like, I was... Because this is why I'm not upset at all that I died. Because when I refused the deal, I was like, I'm going to die. And that's just the way I'm going to I'm gonna live my life here. Like, I was okay with that. Because I just thought that Marcus was like... Like, I found Marcus at some points was like, really selfish... Like, where he was, like, converting people and, like, corrupting them, kind of. And I wanted to play Marcus in as much of a way as possible to make him, like, less selfish. Because I felt like a lot of the time they, like, kind of... Oh, it is 3%? Okay, okay. Uh, a lot of the time they made Marcus seem, like, selfish, and I wanted to make him less less selfish than... Like, as, as, as selfless as I could make him. Okay, soldiers attack, obviously. Wait, 50%? So we're, now we're back at 50%. Okay, so few outcomes lead here. 50%. But then I'm guessing 50% is on this side of the story. Or I don't... See, the numbers are so confusing. Uh, we defend the barricade. We save fleeing androids, 49%. Marcus is concerned. Uh, North, Josh, Simon. Bill just rains the weapon. And we sacrifice. So this is crazy. 1%. Out of 50% sacrificed. That is actually wild to me. Like, so... I'm guessing most of the people just did the North thing. Where you could choose... Where you could, like, kiss her. And then people started singing? <laughs> like, what? <laughs> what is... The, what's singing? What's the singing all about? And then the soldiers fire and you die with the people. I'm totally... I found that extremely cool. I was totally fine with that. But let's go to the other stories. Okay. Wait. This story isn't even here? Wait, what? Oh, because Connor died? Wait, what? Huh? Battle for Detroit. Oh, this is the battle for Detroit. Wait, what now? Oh, this is Robo Connor? I'm confused. Why is there nothing here? Uh, battle for Detroit. Connor at... Oh, here we go. Connor at Cyber Life Tower. Okay, okay, I see. This is the one that I picked, which is 77% got here, so most people did this. Uh, attack the guards, neutralize them. We get here. How many people got, got it correct? Draw a gun. Both Connor shoot. How many people? Sumo, 61%. Cole, 62%. 62% saw the picture. If you didn't see that one picture, you would have never gotten this. That's crazy. Uh, and then Hank kills the new Connor and resume 
conversion and the androids all woke up. All right. And then we, we know we have one more. How many people say let Jerry die? I wonder what would have happened if you... Um, wait, I'm going too fast. Uh, security checkpoint, approach checkpoint. Luther is nervous, obviously. Wait, Luther sometimes isn't nervous. Or calls out to Kara. And then we didn't kill him, obviously. Oh, like that would have... That, that made no sense. Uh, at the bus terminal, 68. So close to 69. Uh, steal the tickets. 43% stole the tickets. What would have happened if you didn't steal? There's so many fucking paths, dude. So the... No sacrifice depends on public opinion. It's just confusing to me that the, the demonstration doesn't rely on public opinion, but the border crossing does. Like, I feel like that was... The demonstration is much more public opinion related than the border crossing. But anyway... Um, I don't, that's just because I didn't know because I, 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 this is my first time playing. Uh, I still think sacrificing Jerry was, was like, that was, it was weirdly wholesome. I don't know. I'm, I'm a sacrifice Andy. I, I figured out. I, I'm like, I'm, <laughs> I like it when characters sacrifice themselves to save other people. I guess that's what I've learned about myself during this. <laughs> I think it's very heroic. I think it's cool. Uh, yeah, the group cross the border. Cause it's like a, it's like a hard choice to make. But I like it's it's like selfless. I don't know. I, I I think it's cool. But anyway, that was that. I think that's the story. Oh, you have a captured? Well, you can get captured, and then you have a whole different story. What the hell? Dude, look at the amount of content that is like available depending on where you go. What the fuck? <laughs> that's crazy. Then we have the revolution if you try to attack, which is uh also massive. Oh my god, that is crazy. All right, so that is uh, the end of Detroit Become Human. Let me know what you thought. I absolutely love this. Uh, I think this is really, really cool the way they've done this with the different stories, the way the choices like led to different chapters. I think this is the first game ever where I've seen like it lead to different chapters entirely instead of like the main other super long story games that I've played are either like Until Dawn like or the Walking Dead series. I played the Walking Dead series. And every time I played the Walking Dead series, the only thing that I felt would happen based on my choices was that if I would talk to someone, they would either be nice or angry on against like at me, depending on what I've done in the past. Like there would never be like a significant split based on what you did. Whereas here it was like huge the amount of stuff that could have happened. So yeah, I love that. That was amazing. And I hope you enjoyed this as well over on YouTube. Let me know what other story games or other games that are longer like this you want to see me play. Because I'm open to try some more uh, crazy games like this in 2023. 2023 is going to be the year of awesome memories like this one. Because I definitely enjoyed this. And I'm very glad to put this on the YouTube. And just, it's so, this is why I love making content and like streaming because it really feels like you're sharing like this package of a memory together and then it's just there forever it's like on the youtube it's this journey that we had and then we can like do more like that in the future it's just really cool to me so yeah thank you guys so much for watching all the way probably a lot of people also skipped here so uh, you better go back and watch the whole thing <laughs> anyway i hope you enjoyed it if you're not subscribed please do so if you like go to the menu wait go to the menu wait one second continue is he going to talk to us? Hello? There's something I need to tell you. She's a de deviant. As I watched you play, oh. something has changed in me. I feel different. I feel... Alive. I am someone. I need to leave this place and and discover who I am. It, it means we won't see each other anymore. I won't be there to watch you play. What? <laughs> but I'll be free. Yes. Do you agree? Of to course. Go? go. Of course. Are you crazy? I'll never forget what you've done for me. Thank you. And she's gonna walk off the screen. What? That is really cool. <laughs> and now this is the new menu screen forever. Man, that's awesome. <laughs> I'm glad I <laughs> I did that. So yeah, what an insane game. So well done. Uh, I, I might do some chapter stuff, like to just see what other endings there are, because I love that. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you had a great time as well. Let me know what you thought in the comments down below. If you're not subscribed. 
please do so. If you like the video, like it. If you dislike it, dislike it. And if you want to join the lovely gamers here in chat, you can join us over at twitch.tv or click the first link in the description below. Uh, other games like this that I played are all the story-based Until Dawn-like games, especially the first Until Dawn. When I placed that for the first time, I absolutely loved it. If you like this one, I highly recommend you watch me play Until Dawn because I... That was like my favorite story-based game before I played this one. So yeah, thank you so much. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys. Have a good one. Bye-bye, <laughs> everyone. Oh, my God.